If it, one, two, that's nah, usually the other way down. Yeah, yeah. Right. Well then. Three, two, one. So the man behind the scenes is finally <laughs> the man in front of the camera. Uh, yeah. Introduce yourself. Uh, my name's Oscar. Fucking, uh, I'm a Devon boy. Bring the mic, mic a little bit closer. I'm the um, basically the guy who is behind the camera, sat in the corner of the room, editing, and yeah, the person that no one ever sees. Basically, mm. yeah. Other than that, fucking not a lot here at here for uni. Yeah, yeah. studying film. Mm. Yeah, not a lot. Not a lot. When did you come up? July. Oh. Came up a couple of months before just to like get a job and what this July? Yeah, yeah. Just to sort of like explore the city a bit. Like yeah. I knew Bristol before just because it's not far away from Exeter. Yeah, it's kind of close, isn't it? Yeah, but the, I mean the music scene in Exeter, like especially for hip hop and like yeah, I played like, there. Urban shit. Is, <laughs> there's not a lot. There's you get your average like chart clubs. It's usually a good vibe though when you do play it there. It is because that's the thing. Like. I mean, I remember when I first met you, you were talking about like you did a show in Exeter mm. at Move and you said like it was one of the best shows. Like, you, like in, I think I'm pretty sure it's Exeter. I'm, f I'm pretty sure it's Exeter. I did an Exeter show and it was bad, but. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, I don't know. I'm 50 I'm, 50. You never yeah, know yeah, where yeah, you yeah. It was at a place called Class A. The, the, when, the venue when was, was it? What year was that? Because uh, they yeah, change all the fucking time. That's the problem. 2010, probably. So I know that. Yeah, that's before I was out clubbing. Yeah. I was 10 years old. I was in when the event. When the venues were classic. You born in 2000. Yeah, man. Were you? That's yeah. so mad, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> like no way. July as well. So I'm like one of the young ones in the year. Like yeah. yeah. Fucking I hell, man. Fully on stuff. Like, I remember, but <laughs> I wasn't quite yet fully on stuff. I was fucking, I was 10 in 2000, really? yeah. Fucking hell, but. You used to, like, at that age, were you thinking about, like, music and, like, thinking about, like, yeah, I could I could try and, like, nah, do that? Or was it, like, nah, like, nah, nah, like, nah, 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 not at all, man. At that age, I was, like, when did I thinking about fucking... When did I meet you? I met you 50-50 early days. Yeah. Like, like pre-split profits, but you were spitting. Yeah. What? Well, hold on, hold on. So, fifty-fifty. Yeah. Pre-split profits. Yeah. yeah. So I would have been fifteen. Right. You so it would have been two thousand and five. I was doing a night at Cozy's, and I remember you came up. You were like, "Oh yeah, let me put me on and shit." Like. <laughs> <laughs> Just trying to hustle my way in. Yeah, yeah from that, young that's, age. That's when I first knew you. Definitely, like way before. Bit profits. Yeah, yeah. I, mean, I think I like remit you in it with Luke and everyone. Else. Yeah, but that was like five because that was like so. Uh, back to what you're saying, I wasn't like thinking about music when I was ten. Yeah. When I was eleven, I started skating. Mm -hmm. Like, and then skating just was all Is that consuming. How you kind of met like people like Luke and shit. Or were yeah, you that's how. School, we, like? Well, it's mad because me. Well, I met um, Paro mm -hmm. and um, rest in peace, my friend Monty, um, who we. We spoke about before in the bill next one. Yeah, um, yeah I met them at Dean Lane, mm -hmm. and uh, then like we obviously started skating together and shit like that. And then yeah. through Paro, I met um, up front and the Flying Monk on mm. um and like a few other people and stuff. And we just like share yeah. friends, big group of people, or whatever. Um, and then yeah, it just kind of grew. Do you know what I mean? It grew through graph and skating and stuff. But yeah, a lot of the people like uh, Bubonic as well, we met through skating. Yeah. Um, even the the kids who got me into spitting, mm -hmm. who the, probably the reason I actually fucking rap with skaters, uh, shouts to Liam and Pickles. Yeah, yeah, I've heard about Pickles. Koval, yeah. yeah. Cause like I think I've spoken about that before on the podcast mm. about them like yeah. uh, Liam's brother being yeah, so is a and yeah, 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 yeah so how good were you at skiing like can uh, you, yeah yeah you <laughs> can pull some <laughs> shit up <bro. laughs> yeah I can yeah, I can, yeah, nah. I can go look in a couple of things yeah no, nah um a couple of things no, yeah, I'm not yeah. gonna lie man like I'm only I, I can't say anything I was shit at skateboarding yeah, it, was, nah, it was a phase when I was like twelve when I yeah died I got hard. deep into it man I yeah, broke yeah, a lot of bone skating I committed like I committed like a lot of life <laughs> yeah. to skate uh, it hurts doesn't it it hurts I now I do mate I've, yeah. I've seen some of my friends like I mean fucking wow. shouts to Ed Bailey and, and uh, Joe Evans fucking they, they these like I've seen friends who skate and I look at them and I'm like I don't have not to say like I it would be so much fun and I would love to do it and like there's a weird kind of like camaraderie with people who skate like you could yeah you can go from, anywhere in the yeah, world yeah exactly you could be speaking a different language you can yeah. kind of like find some common ground 
but like I, I personally I, I could never do half the shit they do. Like, mm. trying to manual down a fucking scared. like uh, like a half pipe or some shit I'd be like nope I'm going yeah. on my ass straight away yeah I mean I'll it's stick like to, stick to filming filming people skate uh, did, what, did you make skate videos then? Did you? I did a couple but never really like made that my thing like I yeah. knew people at college who did it a lot and I felt like if I did it I would kind of just be like making the same thing as them like yeah. I didn't feel like I could have anything new to add to it but I mean it was also something I'd like to do more like I've seen some really I kind of like yeah. snowboarding videos like my uncle used to hey. love snowboarding oh, I'd love to go and snowboarding man mate Sierra Nevada it's the cheapest and most warm fucking um, resort where is it it's, it's southern Spain yeah. it's the closest it's like near Malaga yeah so when I go and see my like parents and shit like in December like sort of time it's what about, for like a day's pass I went once it was 80 euros like pass and you get your snowboard and you get like your boots and shit uh, and it's not like it's not amazing but it's yeah it's all right, like, uh, it sounds is. sick man i do need to do it at some point because everyone's like yeah like if you can skate you can snowboard do you know what i mean it's just a yeah, bit more like carvy like, yeah. like you yeah. gotta make sure you I'd don't say like, it's dig. more similar to surfing like i was never yeah. good at surfing but like i could skate a little bit so i kind of could learn the fundamentals but you met the first time i went you I'd, I'd say take lessons because otherwise you're gonna fucking bruise your spine, your yeah. coccyx, your yeah. fucking like everything. Like, the worst thing is being strapped in. That's the worst thing. You can't just jump off in it. No. Yeah. Your, your feet are proper strapped in. Yeah, I just, I don't know. I've always just been like, I can just, I. I can just, I think it's going to be easy, you know, when you've got like a, an unfathomable no, that's, that's what I confidence. Went in yeah. And then I was like, actually, no, nah, this I've is got fucking ex- hard. Yeah, I've got to experience yeah. that. Like, I need to experience don't, it. Don't I need to do it in peace, though, or whatever it's called. Is it peace? Yeah. Like the, yeah, the, yeah, the yeah, thick yeah. snow where yeah, it's yeah, like, fluffy, kind of like, yeah, yeah. If you do it on ice, like, you're kind of. No, fuck that. I wouldn't want to start on ice. Nah, nah. I'd be. I've done it in Churchill, wouldn't it? No, not Churchill. Yeah, Churchill. No, Churchill's. No, I've done the dry slope. I did the fucking little dry slope ski thing in Churchill, man. Yeah, if you fall off that, that leaves a proper, like, fourth degree burn. Yeah, it's basically just like flat rope, isn't it? Yo, where we just played in Greece. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. In the venue. It was in the venue, yeah. In the place in. in It was in. Oh, was it? So I can't even remember. Fuck. Nah, Salonica. Um, the venue was crazy. It was like this. It looked like a skate park, like half of it. And then there was like a bar the slash. One? Yeah, the yeah, big one. Yeah, it was nuts, was man. Smart. And um, at the back of it, there was this big glass window mm-hmm. with like a. What do you call it? Almost like a fucking. Um, I'm pretty high right now. <laughs> so if I take a while to say shit. Right, what, are, what are the things? Like a running. <laughs> a treadmill, a treadmill, but yeah, not a yeah. treadmill, but like a f- for skis. Oh, right. So oh, like this right. giant like patch, kind of like how they have those for like surfboards, like yeah, waves. Yeah, like, yeah, like, yeah. Like, like, I don't, like you get them on like jets, like no, 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 like cruises. You can like fake. Have you seen that? Shit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. With yeah. the, the water's coming up, yeah, but this yeah. wasn't like there wasn't com- anything coming up. It was just like a fuck. It was just the land was coming. Yeah, yeah. yeah the land that was, was like, the <laughs> worst <laughs> fucking description. No, I get the gist. I get, I, I get the gist. It's like a treadmill, but they're kind of like skiing. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, these yeah, pe- yeah. these guys were just on it, like just like just sh- in the club, in the club, <laughs> <laughs> just like there, that's just mad. fucking. That's mental. Yeah. Yeah. It was fucking crazy. I need to play some of them videos. Yeah. Mate, Shouts I, to everyone out in Greece, man. Mate, Shouts I, to Oliver I, Section Red as well. If a pub in Bedminster pulled that out, I would I would actually like I'd yeah. throw all my money away. Like that would be amazing. Yeah. yeah. If the Jolly Folly is fucking pulled that it out, it looked like, fucking sick. Like I don't know if you, I don't know if you could do it on a snowboard because like. You're digging your heels in, because or you you have to like dig. You have do to like. You, you have to actually like propel yourself forward. No, 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 no. That's no, no. like on a slope. So they're just they're literally just there in one place, but they're like practicing their. If you can do maybe. it, maybe. balance you and shit. Yeah, I suppose. Yeah, yeah. Same thing. Yeah. One piece of advice I will give you is don't like follow the advice that my uncle gave me. And, like he tried to fool me, and was like, "I'll try and take the button lift up the like up the slope. The button lift is mostly for skis." Oh shit. Um, like I was just like I was, I can't remember how. What's, was, what's the difference? What's the button? Basically, lift the button lift is like it has your hands, you hold it, and it just like pulls you up the mountain. It just like drags you up. Okay. Yeah. As opposed to like a chairlift. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like it's on a like an actual like, elevator. Like yes. Yeah. And um, yeah, I tried to go up there and fucking like looking around me like, why am I the only fucking person with a snowboard? But like, I got too far in because everyone like sandwiches you into like this tiny little like walkway. 
far. And I got too far, and like someone was saying, like, oh, sorry, basically, I've just got a piece of like not whatever you do, like this baby. guy spoke to me in Bulgarian. <laughs> don't, don't do it in a snowboard. And he was just like, don't do it in a snowboard. And I was just yeah. like, obviously couldn't understand because it was in Bulgarian. I just went up and like just <laughs> fucking ate shit, man. Ate shit like straight away. Yeah, don't ever. But yeah, snowboard like videos look sick. Are amazing. Like there's one called like the Art of Flight. Right. It was one of the most expensive at the time. It's a few years old now. It was one of the most expensive snowboarding videos to make. Like, okay. Yeah, cost millions. Like they used some of the Go highest there. frames. Sorry. Oh, frames. Ooh, come on. Get up, Lou. Shout out to Lou. This is my pup for so fucking. What are you saying? Nine years now. I've had her. I think is it? she's nine. eleven. Yeah, I got when she's two. Nine years. Eight years. Yeah. The front cover there as well. Yeah. Who did the artwork for that? Uh, Helen. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, sick man. She's done like, she did a load because the original one that like I was going to use was like blue, but she was like more silhouetted. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Out of breath. Jesus Christ, <laughs> I'm off it. Um, and she was like looking up and, but yeah, we ended up changing it. Because, um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but it's the first record we dropped on Green Brick. Is that the first yeah, one? Yeah, it's the first one. The thing I love most about that album, and shouts to Dom and this and that media, is the music videos. Yeah. Like, the, um, that kind of hurts. Does it? <laughs> nah, no, no, that's true. <laughs> fucking... Nah, he no, killed I mean, it. music's great, man. Like, yeah, nah, nah, I'm just, I'm fucking, I'm, fuck, I'm fucking fuck with you. But obviously, from my perspective, like, that's yeah, another yeah. thing that adds to a song, is like, if it's got a banging music video, it's like, rather than listen to it on Spotify, yeah, yeah. like, nah, I'll watch it on YouTube. Yeah. Like, and, I mean, is that something that, like, when you go in, like, when you release an album, do you want to have a lot of creative control over, like, the videos, or do you kind of let people run wild with it do you kind of like it? yeah it depends yeah. like with with Dom and the videos on that track I mean, on that album like with people you know and stuff it's like that was like my concept of having like mm -hmm. a bit zooming up to the next person and yeah, stuff yeah, so yeah. it's like a lot of back and forth especially with me and um, this and that because we've worked together on fucking loads yeah. of shit now yeah and like obviously he lived here like for a while. Warrior, for example, with Section Red, you kind of have like a shorthand of like... Yeah. There's not like, say for example, if you're working with someone new, it's going to be a longer path to like getting what you want and getting... Yeah, it's just the easy, it's an easy relationship. But it's like, especially those two, mm. like with them, it's like you can just suggest things, things get like either accepted or shut down. It's all very like honest and easy. Do you know what I mean? And when you can act, especially with Dom and like what with, with him and his concepts, like if you can ask him like, oh, can we do this or try this out? Like with little brother, it was like, he posted a yeah. clip of like the kind of inception mm -hmm. idea of him like, zooming out of a photo like, into a photo. Yeah, and I was like, bro, yeah, yeah, yeah. can we do this yeah, as a video? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then it was like, all right, we had to plan out every shot. So like, I had to do stuff, storyboard, yeah. and like we all did. Mm. Like, do you know what I mean? And yeah, yeah, because there's it was a lot of it was a lot of work, mm -hmm. but he brought the idea to life. Yeah. You know what I mean? Mm. And he's like, Ollie could like Ollie can definitely do that as well, but he's got a different style of what he's doing. He's yeah, doing yeah, like a, yeah. a lot of videos. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Um, yeah, because the they're thing, both doing fucking, something like what Dom and uh, this like media has been doing, like takes time like you yeah. like the, the the planning and ultimately the editing like it yeah. takes a long time like whereas you know you can go out and you can shoot a music video and maybe you can make it look cool just from a day shooting mm. of not really like any story or kind of main visual effect but when it comes to editing it's going to be like a much simpler process mm. but like you know like you said if you kind of have this clear vision throughout you can tailor everything and actually, yeah. like in some ways it streamlines it but you can't afford to like be setting short deadlines on no. those videos because it's take it's a long process. Yeah. The same like even when we started filming these first podcasts, like it's I kind of didn't know what I was doing. Like it was all new. Didn't to Didn't know me. what you're getting yourself into. Well, it was, <laughs> in it was like like that. I knew roughly, but it was like all new. <laughs> oh <territory>. shit! <laughs> I'm in deep now, but it, yeah. it was I'm, I know what I'm doing now, and like mm. I mean, I this is the ultimate test if I can just leave it there and and and, hope and it works. Yeah, good, but, yeah. check halfway through. See what's yeah, going. I mean, I can see from here it's still recording, so we're good on that yeah. front.
Yeah. yeah. And pull things like this out of the bag. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's good, man. Like, being adaptable. You know what I mean? And uh, the studio will be moving as well, so. Mm. When is it you are moving? The hopefully, new like, New Year at some point. Um, but, yeah, the new place is the so top it's top it's of the house again, isn't it? So, the fucking... Yeah. Nice, nice. The attic, the upper room. It almost I happened. Love, I, did yeah. like that, yeah. I do like the name, man. Yeah, yeah. 100%. It's no, just, it was, um, there's too many was, double entendres with that. Was, yeah, uh, there's like a few. It was a Christian podcast, didn't it? Yeah, that was oh, it. Oh, it was, it was a Christian podcast. Oh, oh, it was a Christian podcast. Yeah. Also, like, to be fair, that that connotations of it being like constantly on the upper rooms and shit. Now, the upper room is as heaven, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. It comes from, I got it from the film Life. Is it? Eddie Murphy and Martin Lawrence. Yeah. He's like, the upper room. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's why I took the intro thing when I made that intro. Okay, yeah. yeah. I never heard that, to be fair. Yeah, that's where it came from. But, oh, um, but yeah, fucking, when I saw it, it was a Christian podcast. I might have to go ahead I just and listen to the Facebook like, like, basic one, of it? Just a basic search, and that was the first thing. I would, no, I would have loved if we it. did stick with it. Evangelical <laughs> yeah. shit, man. I was just like, oh, Millions, like, <laughs> fuck that. Yeah. It would have been brilliant if we did stick with it. <laughs> everybody that kind of actually wanted to listen to about, like, Bristol hip-hop, like, just typed that into Google and just got directed to Evangelical, like, yeah, exactly. yeah, podcast, <laughs> like, like, just getting mad at us. Like, we can't find it. Like, what the fuck? Yeah, no, it was, yeah Kanye sponsors us, really. <laughs> That's what's meant to happen. Yeah, we're controlled, man. <laughs> this happened. But um, how did you get into it, anyway? How did you get into filming? Like, why was that, instead of um, it being, like, was it... Were you into the music before yeah, you were into obviously. like filming well, or did it come no, with the it, skating it was or? Filming before, like it, I remember probably, I mean, I always loved watching movies. Like, yeah. Some of my earliest memories are like going to my nans and like her like, rewinding the VHS and shit and like putting it in and like, well, yeah. like watching some Disney animations or something. But then like, shouts to my dad, he, he showed me movies that I shouldn't have watched at the age that I did, like shit yeah. like Goodfellas and yeah, man. these films by people like yeah, Scorsese like, like, and like Coppola and all these people and it was like my young mind was a bit like what the fuck is this and <laughs> this is cool as fuck like yeah. it would be amazing to like yeah. have any sort of Goodfellas is a crazy movie as well like, <laughs> man I, used to I, to I, was like 10, I shouldn't have been watching none of it oh. <laughs> <laughs> you got stabbed like 27 times in the boot of a car that's and that <laughs> off key like, super off key I've got like, a question mark it's like uh, yeah. watching it before school as yeah. well go to school you right. basically like see when he got stabbed up 10 times like, <laughs> wicked wasn't it like, no it wasn't really good but <laughs> no but when but when you're that young, you just like you've never seen anything. Like, you never, yeah, you're not allowed. So it's almost like forbidden. So you're like, oh, this is this is awesome. It's kind of like I can't really think of an, an analogy. But after that, it kind of um, my uncle studied uh, photography, so he always like had cameras around the house. Mostly yeah. uh, at that time would have been film. So like I would mostly learn how to use a camera and shit, but would never actually see it, like because mm. we just would rarely actually get it developed we weren't like super rich and shit um but he was the main one who kind of like encouraged me to like actually if you want to do it then there's nothing stopping you it's just kind of getting a camera and like yeah i've made so many terrible films like have you terrible, what like, oh, um, like, well, like what like, kind of films class, like me like directing acting and like having my sisters yeah. is it like, what well, oh, mate I'll, sh- I'll show you sometime can you yeah. level up that light behind you a bit because yeah, that shit's hurting my eyes so all right. Yeah, that's a lot better. Yeah, that's like beats, man. You need to make a hundred shit beats before you make a good one. Isn't it? Like, yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah. I think yeah, you yeah, need yeah. to do that with everything. Same as bars, I guess, isn't it? Yeah. Like, you know what I mean? but, but I think, like, I'm trying to some of the films. I, I made one film that was. This was actually a college project, but like, <laughs> it was as a as a. a <laughs> it was a. The story was. I thought the story was actually quite strong, but it was a about a delivery rider who like gets called to a house to drop off some food but as he comes there he like stumbles on a murder and I, I, I'd never seen anything like that done. I feel like it'd be done alright yeah. wrote a script that I thought was good yeah, and like that. I don't know like think like when you're that age you don't really have any experience so you're kind of just winging it the whole time and you're yeah. working with other people who are also winging it yeah. and mate like I remember it, I'd al- it was already late in like the deadline had already passed I hadn't finished it and I um I had one last like scene to film, like the very end of the film, and essentially like 
what happened is my actors went on holiday because obviously term was over and I was still struggling like pulling my hair out and I was just like fuck it I'm gonna get two people that look nothing like the original cast. So I need to get, in and get them to like get them to just like go in. The people like shouts to Will and James, big ups. Did they fill the gaps? Did they? They fill the gaps. They stepped and, like, in. Uh, if they watch this, they'll fucking they'll remember that. But it was it was not my best work. Luckily, I passed. Thank fuck. Yeah. Big uh. ups to my teachers for. <laughs> Letting me, letting were they me understanding? They were like, 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 but, uh, you know, I'm here now. I'm at uni, so... Yeah. Second, was that all second in... Year, uh, second year I pulled out. I yeah. Another bag actually made something that was... Okay. What was it? A short film? It was a short film. Um, it wasn't my idea. It was based off of a short story that my... Um, a friend of a friend wrote. It was basically about a guy who, like, wakes up in a room and it's, like, a completely white room and there's just a, a door and, he, like, he walks through the door and he's, like, in a memory from his life and every time like in the distance he can see another doorway and he like keeps walking through it and he eventually like by the end you realize that he's woken up in a coma like he's been in a coma and it's like it's his brain like kind of yeah sure. dying, like in the stages of dying did he have like flashbacks to mem like him realizing that it's a memory within the kind, rooms kind of like what i can't remember i what exactly happened in his short in his short story but the idea that I adapted from it was like a guy who would he was like losing out on his house so basically he got in he got involved with some shady shit like borrowing off of loan sharks and stuff had no way to pay it back and like once his wife like found out about all this shit that he's been doing he like storms off and, and then like has to get some space and he gets into a car accident so like the idea is that he's like the whole time been in a car accident and kind of like remembering how he got there Okay. Yeah. But, I mean, it, it it was something that if I had like a year, like an like an actual like maybe some money, because that's the the thing was the yeah. visual effects, like there were things I wanted to film in an actual hospital, but that yeah. shit's impossible. I'm a at the time I was a 16 year old kid, no money, like no reputation as being like yeah, your hospital is going to be seen in a big film. Yeah. So it was like yeah, fuck off. We're busy. We're the NHS. We're underfunded to shit. Yeah. So we cannot let you. <laughs> yeah, just, yeah. Just use this room here, man. Like, it's we'll casual. Wheel out you the could in like a cleaning just, closet or something, or yeah, like the yeah, toilet. Yeah. So, but yeah. So we just had to green screen it. It just looked horrible, and it was like it, yeah. it was the sort of sort of thing that if we could just rent out like a big room, put some lights up, put a green screen, and get a bed, it That's, would look good. Do you know what? That's but, something like in the future. Like, I'd love a load of us to invest in. What is like a wet, like a yeah, well, like a. Not necessarily a warehouse, but like a unit, you know what I mean? Yeah, Some yeah. sort of unit somewhere in Bristol where we could make our own studio, you know what I mean? You can get places for dirt yeah. cheap if they're a bit rago. Probably Jimmy, not in Bristol build, anymore, you but... You could build it up, that's the whole point. Jimmy was but yeah, you just man, build man. a... We, shit, well, we can... could just build a fucking big room inside a warehouse. Yeah. So you go into it and it's just a studio. You could have like two walls of it. Well, it? He, yeah. He's always talking that, man. Yeah. Especially in London and that is where our space is, man. In London, you could do it a lot yeah, easier, I reckon, because there's so much spaces. more space. All the space here now is just getting fucking snapped up. It's like it's just there's nothing in Bristol. Nah, gonna put like in all, the, all, the, all the all the places we used to. But now it is you pay your full rent and bills or yeah. on the fucking street. Yeah, that's no, nah, that's it. Like that's you know how they say seventy percent of fucking people in England are one paycheck away from being homeless. Yeah, I am. Everyone, yeah. Everyone, yeah, 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 yeah. Everyone like, is. If I don't know how yeah, I'm going to pay my bills. But you're a student, uh, surely you get that shit subsidised. I'm from Bristol. I need so to, I, I get my next student loan payment in January, but I'm going to apply for a student bank. bank yeah. I don't know, I'm just going to start job hunting tomorrow. Yeah. But I can't <laughs> get a job, man. It's fucking come back to Christmas. Christmas work. There's a lot of Christmas work. Most students go home, innit, at Christmas. So there's loads of work available. There's bare work yeah, at Christmas. Yeah. There's bare work at Christmas. I was thinking though, like maybe it's a good, maybe it's a good thing because I can actually spend more time on video. What was your job doing? Just pub, just bartender. Yeah, no, you can get a million other jobs. Yeah, exactly. But I don't know if I want to get another pub job. Yeah. Because like, what I could be doing on a Saturday night 
instead I could be applying to clubs or artists to be filming music videos. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, yeah. Like, what you should do is like get your get like a few like um, sorry, I'm away from the fucking mic. Get um, like a few speci- uh, specific skill sets. Yeah. Do you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, like yeah. figure out a couple I, of like effects that you can do. Things. Do you know what I mean? Like. Mm-hmm. Make sure your like colouring's tight mm-hmm. and your grading or whatever, and fucking get a few things that you can do to make it like yours. Is, so you know what I mean, or yeah. something that's a bit different. You've got yeah. to have a day job um, to pay the bills, isn't it? So it's about selecting exactly. The day that's, job that's or, yeah. Thing. Or the fucking. But as a student, as now's the thing. time to do it. Exactly. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. As much free time is as nah, like, like when you come so out of uni and like you have to get a job right yeah, now. Yeah, you should, yeah, exactly. Like use this time to fucking. Get yeah, your yeah, film, like, build, yeah, like build something, build, build a, and yeah, build get a to brand. the end of the three years yeah. and like have spent all this money and be like, well, what have I got to show for it? I mean, that's why like being able to do um, like that night, for example, the, mm. the Halloween night was good. Yeah, there was fucking. I mean, like that was my, that, mate, that was my thirteen-year-old dream. Like when I started listening, <laughs> to you, honestly, like, <laughs> mate, like fuck it's me, fucking like, mad. Dad, weed it. masons came it's on. Just like, fuck me, I lost my mind. Yeah, that was most fun I've had in years. Like, and it was good and those fun. Pictures are wicked as well, man. Yeah. Like, mate, the videos. Oh my god. You got a wicked one of me. Mm. It's just the back of my hair. So yeah. I, it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I didn't know. I didn't know. No, if want, sick, I didn't know nice if you want picture. faces out there. I just thought, you know. Nice and sick. Keep them man. anonymous. It's got the whole crowd and it's just the back so. of my head. I'm like, yeah, I use that one. But, um, <laughs> the the videos look. Look beautiful. Yeah. I'm gonna try and at least have something to show for you. Like, yeah, if you can get something over. Got something on my laptop, but like. Because I, I started editing it to a tune and then you said you wanted it to bad news. So I've kind of like had to go back and like change edit points okay. and shit. But it's... What did it you start editing sense. it? I started it with... I did it. I'm trying to... Uh, do, 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 do. Oh, that reminds me of that on, on a little sidetrack. Have you seen that IKEA yeah, Christmas? Course, I, have, man. I haven't yeah. seen it yet. I just seen the one fucking. Uh, seen the memes, bro. The memes. Uh, Jay tagged me and said, "There's an IKEA memes. magazine. It's got you eighty nine ninety nine. You can get the bub bub bub. Or you can get the bluka bluka. Is you serious? What IKEA smashed it? Yeah, that's some good marketing. What is it? Absolutely disappointed. No, I can't remember. I reckon this the all these like, this like, is depressing like the, oh, that like, grime era. I reckon they're all gonna become superstars. Yeah, they mm. should like a hundred percent. They, they the should be. Day. Yeah, they yeah. were to us. But, yeah, but I'm yeah, saying yeah. they're gonna become like superstars were, in the fucking the yeah. world. You yeah. know what I mean? It's gonna start hitting other countries. Like it's, it's hitting it's America. Good, it's already in this like in a in a way because you have you have different nations version of grime. It's fucking sick. You have Japanese grime. Like yeah, Australian. Just like with hip hop, you have English hip hop. You have. Like and then it's the whole there's the whole fucking argument about yeah but like I've said it I was like the main you know what I mean I said it yeah. on Facebook like fucking why does everyone call it UK hip hop or, or French hip hop because uh, mm. it is yeah, yeah, yeah you know yeah. what I mean it's yeah. all a bit different but and now the world characters man all of the old school ones like gets yeah it should be a worldwide character yeah because that's <laughs> Lethal Bizzle should be a worldwide Definitely. grime is like it's 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 a fact, it's a British done, music they've all gone like, viral in their own way yeah, they yeah. have all gone viral yeah. in their own way to be fair and I but think not like I still think I mean, there's I a lot say, more to come. I, I think it, I think it's in America, like like fully broken. America. Nah, I think I think it's like, still in baby it, steps. It's, nah, it's, it's respected. Compared to, America, it's respected. It's, it's respected. Yeah, in a way. but they both live there. Both. Like, yeah, they yeah, nah, but I think I think they're playing shows every day. Over they're, they're they're like exceptions. Like they yeah they for sure. People are like Stormzy and right. Skepta. I'm not, I talking, I'm not talking America. I mean, if you go LA, I kind, I kind of think they're gonna New York, yeah. them type of places. They're yeah, no dizzy, they're no skeptical. Yeah, but I'm, yeah. Disney, I'm you know? saying yeah, like yeah. they're gonna become more than like that as like I don't know. Like recognized at first within the UK is that when I don't know it's it's changing now. Like yeah. you know yeah. what I mean? Yeah, exactly. Like Stormzy's yeah, yeah. on the front of fucking Time but magazine. Then it's, yeah. But then the thing like, do you know what I'm like saying? And like, but like Blast, I know. Was saying when, not that when Blast came here, he was. No, no, I know. But the, I'm saying that culture, what he's, they've he's, done, he's, he's but they're starting thing. to be recognised as the people that started it. Yeah, so yeah. the fact that Stormzy's on he's the front of Time, thing. yeah, that's gonna be like, well, how did this start? And it's like it goes back to, yeah. 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 But people like them, and inspi- they've re-inspired some of the older people because like. Kano did a sick one really because he did Top Boy Kano just and smashed it yeah. uh, did that like Top orchestral Boy. thing Top Boy's uh, worldwide everyone's watching Top Boy trust me it's not yeah. just UK people that. watching Top Boy and what, then he dropped what do you guys make of it? what do you guys make of the new series did, like, did you watch the I liked original it, I liked it I know it's mixed isn't it everyone's I watched, I watched up to like nah I liked it 
But did I watch the whole thing? I can't even remember. I think I might have missed because like everything's hectic at from the moment. When I'm watching stuff, sometimes yeah, yeah, it'd be like yeah. babies crying. It's like from what everyone I talked to, but it was like, it was sick. It was down the middle, wasn't it? Really and everyone is, says yeah. like. Like it's too dramatized and shit like mm. that, but it's a fucking mm. TV. Program. What Bongo yeah. said, yeah. Like, yeah, but like, like I, I'm not trying to put Bongo on blast. It. Shouts to Bongs, but no, enough people were split down the middle. Everyone's he was like, me. I live in this. You know what I mean? Yeah, he yeah, sees exactly. it every day. It's yeah, like it almost yeah, seems yeah, like yeah. it's it's glamorizing it, but then that's the whole fucking all, avenue of going down that road of, of it, like is it? the whole point of the show is to shed light on it because yeah. if you go back, I mean obviously I wasn't alive at the time, but if you go back twenty, thirty years, you'd never have a show with an all black cast. Nah. About that topic. Nah, on, nah, on, shit on, has on, changed on a big forward. level. Like so that's a big that's a big step and obviously it getting cancelled is yeah. sad news, but for oh, Drake, the fact that people what, obviously what did respect Drake it. Do? He paid for it. I think he funded he, it. He funded it. No, but what, the new funded, series? Yeah. yeah. Not the first one. He funded no, no, the, the, no, no. the... He just he loved the, the first series. series. And then the new one got dropped by Channel 4, basically. That's what happened, didn't it? There wasn't mm. going to be a uh, season three. Yeah. And then that's when Drake stepped in. But I don't know. He paid something. I think maybe he, he put had money, some... but he got the Netflix deal, I think. Yeah, I think so it might have been... to produce the third I'm not too, like, detailed up. I don't know exactly what his involvement was. Because I remember hearing about it I, about, about a year it. ago, and I was like, I hope for like for fuck's sake that he's not in it. No, he wasn't. Because I, I, he wasn't. He, thank so, God. To be fair, he put there was very good people in it. Mm. Yeah, Dave really surprised good. me. Dave, Dave was, good. was a really good character in it. Dave yeah, killed it. Yeah. To be fair, but Lil Sims is in it. She's a yeah, fucking she wicked was, character. Yeah, she was. Yeah, that's good shit. Little I'm, Sims, man, fucking I'm like liking the way yeah, the music is fucking brilliant. Like you checked her album. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She gets played on Radio Six all the time as well. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's like the, to be fair Radio 6 I was going to fucking mention it that uh, oh, yeah, the today's yeah. like Radio 6 band t-shirt day or whatever yeah, yeah. and uh, like they just fucking get sent pictures on Twitter or whatever and talk like play the tune from the from whatever the, 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 you know yeah, what I mean yeah. but um, they were talking about the merch and like it's something that I was, I was talking about before but the merch is like the biggest thing that artists can make money off at the moment with streams. I think someone like, some guy was on there and he was saying, like, I don't know who he was, he's from a band and they had a t-shirt. Yeah. And on the t-shirt it just says, like this t-shirt is the equivalent of 5,000 streams on da da da. Like this is the biggest yeah, way that you can directly yeah. support an artist. Yeah. And when you actually think about that, 5,000 streams, well, it's the same as a fucking difficult. t-shirt. You need the tour yeah. on the t-shirt, innit? To, to like, was it, I think, Habitus or something put something on on Instagram and it was like I think it was a sale of his album and it was like a breakdown of like the like how much he got and how much who, who was that so it was Habitus yeah um, and he like he posted that I, I might not be exactly right but he was like I think he got like one pound eighty from like an eight pound like record sale and it was like yeah. I, it was broken down into all these categories and I can't remember yeah, exactly yeah. what it was mm. like I could go and find it yeah it is like but that, it's but mate it's like and that like what you said one t-shirt or one vinyl or one little cassette tape that might be like five pound yeah. to mm. twenty pound or you whatever need the tour the tour makes money and then you need merch on the tour to maximise mm. the tour innit? because yeah. if you're going on tour that's where your money is that's where you're going to get paid for doing shows yeah so that, if you that's have it. the merch as well that's it like that's and the merch needs to be like every t-shirt is a fucking yeah. is a thousand but it shoes, also it? needs to be like your shit because if, if yeah, it's yeah, a record 100%. label no, 100%. do you know what I mean like then obviously that's that's good as well but it's nice if, if, you're, if you've got your own shit yeah. that you can sell because yeah, otherwise a record label's taking this much blah, blah, blah. yeah yeah no it's you, you know mean, it's but you. yeah it's okay where's my phone popping off man that's nah, mine man it's fucking annoying sorry I can not say that but it's just going mad both of us just like, <laughs> 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 we were gonna flip it. You were gonna ask us questions. Oh yeah, right, well, okay. Yeah. So let's let's. When you were what you got to say? When you were first starting, how like we split profits, and when you when you were first starting learning as a DJ, mm. what was the biggest like? Was there someone that you met, or was there someone that you heard? that kind of you maybe had a moment or had like a period of time where you kind of became obsessed with the idea yeah, or was it like yeah a, I think that's how we'll get started definitely. but who, who was that for you was it was it a group was it someone know, it that you met like, personally or? It's, I don't know man. from DJing it would be later but I would always put it down to listening to 
NWA. Yeah. That was my first introduction of hip hop. I didn't know what hip hop was. I didn't know about the movement. I didn't know nothing at all. And how were you just listening on the radio? Or you no, my friend. Like no, no, my like friend had it on a tape. And it was on a, yeah. Like we were saying earlier, it wasn't allowed, didn't it? It was like fuck yeah, yeah. Because this, well, this is what I mean. Fuck yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, this is bad language, and I was listening to it because I was. Well, like it pissed my mom off, innit? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck the police! Yeah, I don't even know why. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, nah, actually, people was getting chased from police when we was like ten years old. Yeah, ago, but we knew all about all that. I got it wasn't a ghetto level of the police, but we yeah. kind of f- felt the same way. <laughs> uh, but that was my intro, and then after that, I just started seeing like it, it, even within in the I heard scratches like, you know what I mean? And then after, I just yeah, the scratching thing. Because that was one of the things that like resonated with me when I first started listening to hip hop yeah because it's like it's a combination of all these different genres whether it be rock or jazz or, or funk or whatever but the way that it's cut between different genres and different songs yeah, is, is like especially for someone like me who doesn't know anything about music it's like it's wizardry yeah it's basic <laughs> it's, it's like, basic as fuck and that's how it got its identity what's that it? quote from um that documentary hip hop didn't create anything it recreated everything yeah. No, that's a good thing. It's that's basic like it shouldn't mm. happen. It's like it's nobody in music like yeah, you do cover songs and stuff like that, but you wouldn't like steal someone's thing and try to flip it in a different key. <laughs> yeah. and play a different lower key or something. Yeah, like, yeah just jack it. And try jack it like yeah. that. No one was on it. But it's the it But it's just how it how it's how it like it's came so, to be yeah. is just the, the fucking the way the mad music, story like the way the music happened and the beats first yeah. it's like is so ghetto that it's that's, I don't know, it's become a sound, isn't it? Yeah. Like, Jungle shouldn't have happened, but it's become a sound. All of it. I suppose you like could that. say it, but yeah, but yeah, 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 it wasn't all of it, man. Uh, I'd say Jump Up probably could have been done without Will. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I don't know, I like a bit of Jump Up, man. It depends on the mood, I guess. Yeah. It's, it's just, just all depends it's times, how many cans you drop, isn't it? How much play, how they dance But, uh... But no, hip hop, yeah. Gabba, so, maybe. Yeah. Happened, yeah. It? it shouldn't have happened, but. Surely, that, I guess surely Gabba's a meme, isn't it? That can't really be like a Gabba, whole Gabba's fan, a like, meme. fan base. Like, nah, bro, yeah, Gabba's well, not a meme. Gabba's a real thing. Gabba's very real, trust me. I did see a documentary about it, like, like, that like, shit like, like, is advice or real shit. and alive. Yeah, Bristol, I might have to do some, bear, some research. There's bare Bristol that. people that love that shit. Yeah, there's a lot of people that love that they shit. look the same. Sorry, I don't mean to judge everyone, but they do all look the same, innit? <laughs> they smell like Picton Street. <laughs> Picton Street and patchouli. Yeah, patchouli oil and dog shit, that's the same. <laughs> For fuck's sake. It's, like. <laughs> it's all changed down there now, man. Bristol's yeah. changed a lot, to be fair. Oh, Bristol's fair. changed that's a lot. That's talk about, to be fair. Like, like, I, mean, I live... I live but how long have you been there again? Like, what? Since July. Blue, like, blue. Blue, Pat, mate. <laughs> there you go. Just yeah. Can you put the blanket over it? Yeah, that's fine. I don't know what like she's she's acting crazy at the moment because of Leon. Yeah. She's getting real jealous. She's had all the attention for ages. Yeah, yeah. she's just not yeah. feeling it. She's yeah, just... of course. So But yeah, Bristol's changing, so yeah, sorry, I was just getting focused on no, fucking. No, I was no, just no, like, no, oh no, shit. Actually, bring it back to that because we can yeah, talk yeah. about that. Yeah, it has changed massively. Yeah. So, I mean, yeah. Stokes Croft. Like, my... Talk about Stokes Croft from when you was young. It, like, different, like. Well, what would be like your average Saturday night walking what? down, like, past, past the attic, put past, like, Lakota and shit? Cap- like, no, all right, so attic like was alright because that yeah. was always. It used to be the Eclipse Bar years ago, but. Now, if you walked up past there, basically, past Blue Mountain... I'm going to have to take her out quickly. All right. Every you guys carry on, yeah? shop was shut. Yeah. <laughs> it was no yeah. shop <laughs> the, Fuck, really. the bank was there. Yeah. But it was the bank years ago. Mm-hmm. It was the bank, then it was closed, then it was the bank, then the love-in. All right, okay, yeah, yeah. yeah but yeah. when it was back in the old days of the bank. And it was fucking just, yeah, desolate. <laughs> just things has been rough as fuck, man. Yeah, it was rough. Fully gentrified to the, the yeah man. It's, I mean, it's crazy degree. now. In the bank pub back then, there was a. I remember you, my my friends used to drive me down there. There was an open deck night, mm-hmm. and it was. How just old like, were you when you going down to that? Like were you twenty one, twenty two? Yeah. Like no, maybe no, maybe nineteen something like that. Yeah, I can't remember the year anyway. But um, 
Yeah, he used to drive me down there and it was like, literally, you just get 10 minutes. I used to just spin like fucking Keith Murray tunes and shit and just try and have a little <laughs> nice. scratch. But yeah, it was just different. It, like completely, you come out of there and at it was a ghost did you have like decks at home? Yeah, you, like, I had decks yeah, at home. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. And, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. I didn't have decks until, I think like, 90, 98, 99. Yeah. That's when I first got decks. But I first started scratching in like 1992. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like three times just on whatever, just a little. I imagine, life, like, like for you, the like the the change in technology must be pretty. What nowadays? Yeah, nowadays, like yeah, I do when it use comes to production. And I like, use the new technology and, and with with the DJ stuff as mm. well. I fully use like Serato. Yeah, like, like I, I mean, don't. Yeah. My vinyl is basically just there now. It's just <laughs> I don't yeah. really use it, man. You know what I mean? Unless I'm like listening to albums. Mm-hmm. But um, yeah, from scratching DJ and mixing all that type of stuff yeah I use fully on yeah the digital yeah I guess it. nowadays it makes things so much easier it's than amazing like, like any single tune amazing. that you back in the day yeah you'd have to buy if you wanted to do tricks with a record mm-hmm. you have to buy two of them yeah so like that's expensive isn't it yeah 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 after a while if you want so every you beat on the album both, you have to buy two of the albums like one you yeah. can scratch up through them on a computer, you have got yeah. one version of it. You can put it on yeah, the exactly. side. You've got two both copies sides. of everything you've ever yeah. got on your hard on your hard drive. Yeah, that's amazing. Like um, my that my, opens it right my up. friend Ollie, he's not DJ in any way, but he yeah. he just bought like uh, like a couple hundred pound like Pioneer DJ set. No, I yeah, stayed at his yeah, house yeah. the other night. A little digital one. Thing. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Just like and does everything. Not you know, not everything you need to do, but like yeah, for yeah, basic no, shit. No. Yeah, no, there's more it. stuff than we even know now to do. Yeah, yeah, you can run it. Yeah, and like it. he was just like, right, I've I've only got it. I've got barely any tunes. Like let's just look. Let's just fucking download some playlists from wherever SoundCloud, Deezer, yeah. wherever the fuck. And just and just put it on there. Like some on key there, points yeah. and blah 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 and like yeah, stuff. Definitely. And mate, I'm not gonna say I'm a DJ. I was just trying to like scratch like I'm fucking like primo or yeah, like you yeah. or something. Man, and that sounds horrible. It but sounds put, like, yeah. but it's just so the put whole the key like, points in there and it's doable. Isn't yeah, it? man, it's yeah. it's like it's all over my head. At the I always say about that stuff though. It, it it's quite easy to do stuff, you know, with the digital mm. way of DJing. Mm. But I always still say it doesn't make you a good DJ. Yeah. It make it makes a good DJ better, mm. but it doesn't make you a good yeah. DJ. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So but like, that's the whole like. That, has a kind of like rings true in other parts of music as well like yeah I, I, I'm not um, that I'm not very musically inclined but I used to play a little bit of drums I, I never mm. really had a lesson like the only lesson I had was my cousin just taught me basically how to play like a basic 8 Yeah. and just from there we would just like watch YouTube videos but I, I could never afford or had the space in my house to have a full acoustic drum kit so I'd yeah, like play on an electric one but then when you go and actually play on an acoustic kit, you're like, this is a whole, because like dynamics becomes a thing. Yeah. How hard it's you hit it is actually. Yeah, yeah. And that's like something that when you're playing on an electric kit, you have no feel for. You yeah, hit yeah. that fucker as loud, as hard as you want. Yeah, it's going to make the same down. Down. Boom, sound. Yeah, like, it's yeah. not going to. And like, I imagine, like like you said, going from playing, like DJing fully digital to going to mixing vinyl is going to be a completely different. Yeah, I don't like going back now. <laughs> Sorry, all the hip hop fans and that. What, uh, that from Serato? Yeah, I use Serato fully. I don't uh, really want to go back to. Well, but back Serato, to like, the thing with Serato is. reminds me of like a bruise up here, yeah, from my record bag. <laughs> <laughs> Just a bruise on there from the record bag is so fucking heavy. You've got to take doubles of everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you're getting fucking 40 quid or something. Uh, <laughs> it's not worth it, bro. Yeah, Serato so makes exactly. life it makes so easy. Yeah. I've got eight million like, tunes in this like, hard drive, this big. Yeah. Like, mate, I, I, you you must that, fucking man. loads of hard drives. And so every single tune like, that's on there, I've got doubles of. Yeah. I can do tricks. I put cue points in. It's fucking amazing. I'll never go back to vinyl. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> you're gonna get so much hate in the comments. Yeah, like, like, oh, fuck, Rogi. I have like, a scratch battle with all of them. You, I can tell you, you dead them off. I like how I like how your um the news you told me earlier. I don't know if that's like a thing you. Yeah, that's a good one. Yeah, are yeah, you doing cuts for it? Yeah, well, yeah. Do you, do you want to announce it or is it like? No, I don't. Yeah. No, nah, you maybe not. Maybe not until no, it's done. Sam is it's, it's Sam Kratz. Yeah, he's he's gonna come on next week with um someone. Someone special. Yeah, someone special. For not that you're not special. Keep that under it. Oh, yeah, I'm just, I'm just. Uh, Obviously. Yeah, nah. Sad I think, bitch. I think <laughs> it's a sad bitch. <laughs> you just will just me out when, when you need me, and then I go back into like a basement and feed, <laughs> me, feed me on crumbs and like yeah. the, two hours of sunlight a day. Uh, yeah. You're not supposed to talk about that. Oh you? shit! Well, yeah. Now that thing you said—that's uh, off the back of. 
I recorded the Scratch Chorus for Percy in it on Percy Phil's album. Yeah, what? Um, what the recent one? Yeah, with Guilty Simpson. Yeah, 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 yeah. Maybe right. Sparks, like real good. Yeah, but I think off the back of that one, Sam's not asked me to do one with him, so I'm doing cuts for him, which is on a track with J Ru, uh, Ed O G, and Elder Sensei. Yeah, which is yeah, it's mad. That's hard. Can't wait for that. Uh, well, do you know when it's dropping or is it like no a, I haven't even recorded just, it yet uh, soon in it but I'm going to go in on that obviously yeah man, man. Um, you need to teach me more you to, to, yeah, yeah. You, you, he taught um, me how to beat juggle I taught, yeah you beat juggle at my house yeah, and yeah, yeah. you down for me and was beat juggling is that just like you just got like two mitching. copies of the same tune uh -huh. and you start one this side and play yeah. like a break of it like yeah, a yeah. bar and then you do it on the other side and then while you're doing that when you rewind this oh, right. one. Yeah, 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 okay, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It's like part of like the head. Like drums, so you'd be yeah. like, do 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 It's like part of the head and rubbing yeah, yeah, yeah. You have to play that one, rewind yeah. that one. How, like, how yeah, you find that? So it's like, like good it? good oak. Good <laughs> oak. Do you know what I mean? Good oak. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you so you're constantly like winding it back so you get the same like break. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck, man. That's, you got to be like. do like, Bring it back, like scratch in between, and then yeah. Yeah, drop yeah, it yeah. back in and shit. Like yeah, DJing, like, to be fair, like how you said that, like the, half -time the hip hop thing, was like the first thing for you before I even knew what hip hop was. Yeah, like I want this was like before I even. I think this was before I even really like listened to music. Mm. You know what I mean? You listen to music as a mm. kid and stuff, but you don't like have like bands that you thought you're like, oh yeah, yeah this yeah, yeah. or that or whatever. And I wanted to be a scratch DJ. Is it? And it was just like <laughs> completely out of my reach, like you technique know, 12 tens, really like really it just it. It was never going to happen. But it was something that I was always like, yeah, that looks so fucking yeah. sick. Yeah, yeah. Like scratching records would be fucking no, that's sick. The struggle no, man, of the like, DJ, I'm, man. The struggle of the DJ is not being able to get the equipment early mm. because if mm. you, from you choose, you want to be a DJ, mm. you're like 12. Yeah. How are you going to get fucking. I scratched up my mum's fucking. How are you going to get decks and that? And I think it was her mum's. Like record player, oh, no. you know, with the little like yeah, fucking yeah. old school one with, with the needle, the, like, like, yeah, shit, like yeah. on a heavy arm. Yeah, yeah. you know what I mean? It's just like grr, 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 like me My and first scratch him was on a midi midi one where you had the tape deck there, radio, no CD. Like the one, the one that I got downstairs, with, like a stack. Yeah, but no, yeah, but it's Without not separate. It's all in one. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. You had, but uh, the volume was an up one like that. Yeah, so you could get the record and go. Tick, 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 like, that's how I learned how to scratch. Literally, that's how I learned how to I used to rewind the juice video, watch all of the cuts. I didn't know back then that the cuts were overdubbed and they weren't actually the ones that were filmed. What? So were you trying to copy the ones that were filmed? Yeah. yeah and you, and like, you were like, why is it not making the same sound? Anyway, wasn't no. even that that's right. fucked. Obviously, it wasn't Omar Epps, the actor, innit? Obviously, yeah. it was. Yeah. I, I think it was DJ Scratch that did it from EPMD. Is it? Yeah, I think he actually did the cuts on the juice film. But yeah, yeah, so I was like trying to mimic that stuff. Get it all wrong. <laughs> Just yeah. like, why is this not sounding yeah. the same? But it was still so. something though. It was like, this is early, but like 92, 93. Yeah. It's yeah. mad, man. And listening to scratches on tapes and then listening on the tape. Da, 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 da. Flip it over onto the ring. Yeah, man, soldier days. Soldier days, putting <laughs> in the work. Soldier, man. I just had my uniform right every day. Yeah. And I just practice one. <laughs> practice doing it, off, innit? <laughs> Twelve years old. Uh, I think I did that with fucking graph, man. The walls in my yeah, room. Yeah, it's the same thing. Yeah. Like I literally, it got to the point where, like, I couldn't, I couldn't sleep properly. I'd be in my room, I'd be getting headaches and shit because the walls were just like fucking bombed, like yeah, tags on tags on tags on tags on tags, like. Pen the point for where us. It's just like too much. Like, to yeah, look way at too much. It was like, like pub toilets that ain't oh. ever been buffed. <laughs> yeah, you know I'm, what I mean. I'm like like never there, yeah. been buffed. You and like pissed off if you left the house and forgot the pen in it. <laughs> yeah, I did man. No. I'd have to go back. Yeah, like, I'd have to go was. back, bro. I had, I had to, because it, it like it became an addiction, and I wasn't. I'm not even saying like I was a heavy fucking train ride or anything like that. Like you know what I mean. No, but it matter, man. It's like got about. But when you're in that, it's just like yeah. That's why you carried that into like hip hop and spitting. Like that same attitude, I reckon, because this. It's all like, from, it? like it's all one in the same exactly, in yeah. a way. Yeah, well, I mean, there's no better example than Turo's podcast, like the, how the two are interconnected. Yeah, like, of course, man. And, 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 sure and, like, and even skating, is most yeah, like it's yeah, yeah it's funny with skating. Like it's, it's funny how skating like does play like quite yeah. a big part in that 
like the hip hop culture as well. Yeah. You know I, I mean, it's not like, it's not part of it or whatever if you want to get all like. It's probably because it's, it's all like. It I, is because it's all the same kids that's into that is yeah. listening to hip hop, so it is. Yeah. It's, it's a similar demographic, isn't it? Yeah. You don't get many like 40 year old women who kind of skateboard and listen to hip hop. <laughs> Yeah, you do now. You, you, I mean, you do. Okay, you, you do now. Forty. Can't, you'd have to. Yeah, 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 shit. That. There's, 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 there's a lot of forty. Okay, okay it? well, <laughs> it's not. Instagram you know, everybody's free. When you walk, <laughs> when you, you know, you, when you walk through Bristol, Bristol City Centre, and you see the fucking kiddies with a skateboard. I can't remember exactly. Like yeah. near Mr. Wolf's. Normally, it's eighteen, nineteen year old, maybe like twenty, twenty year old yeah. kids fucking doing kickflips and shit. Mm. Not always. I'm. Oh, I'm gonna be fucking ripped apart. Like, yeah, oh, nah. I'm just gonna I'm say. I'm gonna get my privilege. Checked. Nah, like, like, yeah, uh, but, but, no, but Brist, um, the Bristol skate scene now is varied, man. Like, you got fucking everyone. Yeah. From but, like, but, like I know older dudes who still skate ev- like every time they can. Not like, saying older people. No, nah, no, nah, I know, I know. Normally, when people start skating, and normally when people start listening to hip hop, yeah, they're yeah, kind of that, around the same age. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Maybe you know, I know for a fact that like I've been influenced like. T- certain types of hip hop and like certain artists from people who skateboard and like mm. I don't know on I don't, skate videos and shit yeah 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 I like, used to get so much music from skate videos all the time like, yeah like so it's yeah you're right I, I don't know how exactly they're connected I don't I'm not gonna try to explain it but like it probably is like, like a lot of it's probably to do with obviously skate videos isn't it yeah yeah so like skate videos are put on the music that yeah. kind of fits the brand like say America yeah, yeah. remember the shoe company America with the E yeah yeah with yeah. the E yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. Like so they were kind of like a rock, fat time. like Bastards. their brand was kind of rockish, wasn't it? Yeah, Do you yeah. know what I mean? Like all punk, the skaters, Heath Kirch art like, and shit, and it was yeah. all like tight jeans and like rock yeah, and yeah, that. Yeah, and then you got fucking well. DGK, Stevie yeah, Williams yeah, company, yeah, yeah, yeah. which yeah. is like dirty ghetto kids, mm-hmm. which is all like hip hop and you know what I mean. So it definitely influences. Yeah, they made the fattest shoes. If you get into like skating and that's the kind of way you go, say the hip hop side, Mm. then you're going to be listening to all the tunes on these videos. You're going to be like, they like those tracks or whatever as a kid. I like this track sick or you know what I mean? Yeah. So I suppose it's tied in like that. But we're cracking codes, man. (laughs) We're figuring shit out. (coughs) My throat's getting dry. How you guys feeling? Yeah, good man. Yeah, I'm feeling pretty good. It's it's nice how you stepped in after um. It's all right. It's unexpected, but it's, it's unexpected. It's, I actually on appearance. Been quite nice. Yeah. How did you two guys meet? Because I don't actually so, know the beginning of like how basically you, Res. I met you in the in the first meeting. Yeah, yeah, we met the same same day that before, Ollie yeah. Ollie mm-hmm. was there and like yeah, kind of all yeah, that meeting. Yeah. Um, so yeah, that, I basically Seri was looking for someone for the podcast. And I yeah. saw it on an Instagram story, and it was a bit like, "Well, uh, I've got nothing to lose by sending a message or whatever." And yeah. I mean, was it the last podcast you we spoke about a little bit? But like, like I said, I didn't actually at that time have a lot to send. Like, I I done one music video, um, big up Goose and Chill Man for actually yeah, like okay. they're them, yeah, lovely yeah. fucking guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah guys are G's, I just sent Goose a message just out of the blue, and was just like, uh, I'm looking to do film is there any way yeah. that you just let me do one for free and he like actually chucked me a little bit of money at the end so like he obviously, obviously yeah, likes what cool. I did and yeah. um, I don't know when that video is going to be released they've got an album coming out soon so yeah, yeah. they dropped a that. different one they dropped yeah the booze yeah. That, I booze, liked that video yeah. that was good yeah it's hard but um that but dropped yeah, yesterday yeah. it was I think yeah that was yeah those guys are always, that won't make sense know. when this drops but nah, no, 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 it's not, it's, not, it's, not, it's all good but, um after that, yeah, so like, I think that was one of the videos that I sent to you. And other than that, it was like a travel video from when I was in Spain. And it was just kind of like, just showing that I can basically like edit and stuff. Just because yeah. I didn't, I, I didn't have any music like That's themed that, things to send. That, that was so. the mad thing about it. That's why I just like something about yeah. what the way things it. happen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's just interesting. Because I mean, it, yeah, it literally, yeah. cause I you guarantee, didn't send, you didn't, I guarantee you sent me like that one music video. Yeah. And, and then it wasn't. It wasn't couple, really. There was like, a couple of other things. Like, yeah, it was like a, it was a couple I mean, of things, but it wasn't like that music video really isn't like. If, if I could re-edit that now, I'd feel like I could do it ten times better. Mm. Because like, yeah, it's you know, not. It wasn't like a super advanced music video. Or anything. No, it, was it wasn't. Like, it's not. But yeah, yeah. You, obviously you obviously you knew. Yeah, you yeah know, I, I, you I knew, knew you were doing it. Because I know. Because there's just a few brother, people. It was like just a lot of brother, I guarantee them there, there would have been someone else there. I posted it twice, yeah. And yeah, the first time I had like enough people. And then yeah. after that, they were hitting me up. 
and then obviously baby and Rara and mm. then the second time yeah, yeah. a load was, of people hit me up so just stood out, yeah. I, don't, I don't know why it was weird it was just like yeah I think this will work because now it's natural it's like, it's, I'm just interested I, because now uh, it's like perfect isn't it like, I, I mean I'll, like, I'll, mm, be, I'll yeah. be honest that when like the team, Molly, like, <laughs> I remember when you first called me actually I it was an unknown number obviously so I didn't have your number and it came up and I was just like I'm not answering that I don't know I don't know I don't know what the fuck that is I'm like <laughs> and then I said like just this and <laughs> I'm glad like yeah like, you just yeah you just texted back res one and I was just like my girlfriend was next to me and she knows nothing about like UK hip hop she's Spanish like I've played her some of your shit and I think I think I think well, I think one. it's growing on yeah yeah, yeah I said he was just like res <laughs> one like, uh, yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> and, um, and then I'm just like oh shit fuck okay yeah and then I, you know we spoke on the phone and yeah. I obviously didn't you know come across too fan fanboyish because I'm sorry now but I mean that yeah. that was a I, that was it was weird to be honest like I'm it worked out though yeah it worked out perfect. it all worked I mean, out quite nice now that's what I mean yeah, yeah. that's why I was interested yeah. in that, that but it was because it's yeah, it was not so like much. this kind of thing as well I, I think like it needs like, do you know what I mean? Like the base of it at least needs like a consistent, yeah. Like, I don't know, Same. source. <laughs> no, no. we need to all be like it needs to be like a no, little we're, fucking. We're all on the same page. Like yeah. we have been since the, the first time that I met you, and like we all kind of knew what we were like wanted to do. We all knew that it had potential, and I mean it, it was, was an obvious, it was like an obvious for me. Like even though like you know I'm you know I'm doing this like I'm not you know getting paid and anything but to me that's not a disadvantage because it's literally chilling here with you guys every week yeah. there's someone new who has you get to a role to play in the UK hip hop and you know it's up What's to that me now as well because it's not just going to be UK hip hop it's going to well, be well yeah it's going to all you know it's yeah. going to snowball and go into different things so and, 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 and we definitely need to go on the cooking show with crazy as well. I've been yeah that does that need to happen my mind and I, I reckon that does need to happen I mean maybe it's like even just break down like a little like say we do it for 10 minutes just like break down a little outline the way to do it is if, is if you film me doing a, a Christmas food breakdown mm. crazy will just get pissed off and do his own mm. one anyway bait him into doing it yeah bait him into doing it nah well, why don't well. why don't you two do one they yeah, would do one together. That's what that was the original idea. That's mm. yeah. No, yeah, I think that would work. So like you, you yeah. two, two, me and me and Sari can just eat the food and give it a rating. Yeah, man. Yeah. Or well, we'll like we'll, we'll be like because well, there's usually like presenters and then the the, be a guest, the guys. So if the we guys did it like doing it, you know. If we did it in line with this, whoever comes on this, if they had the time, obviously, there's not gonna work every time because yeah. people are gonna be busy. But that would be you could kind of like tie it in so they could either be like released at the same time so you yeah. could have like this week on the podcast you've got fucking I don't know John Doe and then on John and then the fucking crazy cooking show you've also got the same person yeah but it's or they just eat up the food the people that come on the podcast that would be <laughs> ideal really yeah. like that's, yeah. that's, that's yeah. what we were saying yeah, yeah. on crazy yeah. one we you were could saying just like, have it literally have in the shot just yeah. like dig, dig yeah. in like yeah, man. and we can just munch wraps out on that Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we'll eat on the just podcast. they have a full like free cool, like and lovely yeah, meal and we've just all got like little sandwiches yeah. or something do you know it'd be funny Brick if we did that if, if yeah. we did start eating every time yeah it's like just the outtakes video yeah. of Mate. just the fucking yeah. chomps of that <laughs> that's it well, you, can just, you can have like a whole like sound uh, sound bite of just like the cheering sounds or something yeah. like, people just like burping you can make some selection beats out of it. Because I debated like doing <laughs> that with like the clips. Like with there's one with the crazy one especially, where um, like, I did cut one out where it's like you were saying like oh I'm, I'm high as a motherfucker and that shit. Yeah. But you actually instead of saying the words I'm high, you said like me high. <laughs> <laughs> and I, 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 the original yeah. edit for it was basically like the video plays and it gets Probably to you, it, it, get, it gets to you saying me like, high and just like it plays like four times every time it just like frantically zooms in and I was yeah. just like. Yeah. Should I keep it? Why like, didn't you do I'm that? I just got it, and then that's the kind like, of shit I love, man. Yeah, man, that man shit, I like, should have, I should have, uh, but oh. I'll keep, I'll keep it out for next time. Because like I remember, <laughs> I remember thinking like you when I, I when I was younger, mate. I watched the the pack and the Mac with uh, you, and like is that, that was that kind of, old, mate. That's that old? old. I was I was young. Fuck, I was like fifteen. 
I was like 15, 16 when the first when one. When's that come out? Wait, no, 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 surely not. No, surely not. It's 2015 then. Wait. No, wait, if it was two. If you were 15. Put it this way, was it after Dell? No, I was 15. Kilo? I know, I was no, 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 You definitely won 15. No, oh, no, I always get 2005. 2015 mixed up. Put it this way, was it after you. Was it after you guys had dropped uh, DBK? Like, they were Bravo Kilo? Yeah, yeah that's when yeah. I did. After that? Yeah, okay, yeah, 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 so it would have been more like 16, 17, I would have been. Yeah, so actually, yeah. it's not that long ago. But, nice. man, yeah, no, the way the way that's edited was just like, was just weird ago. fucking sound overlaps and just, that's that, what I that was, was going to do. That was this and that, it? Yeah. That's the yeah. kind of vibe, like. That's what I was going to try and I don't know what other do. people find funny. Yeah. And, that's their yeah. opinion. Yeah, 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 but yeah, that shit where it's like snappy. It's, like, it's, I find it funny. Like, I just can't help but laugh, <laughs> but it's that kind of shit that just cracks me the fuck up. Yeah. Like proper fucking cracks me up. That's how you enter like a YouTube hole. Just you go on YouTube and you just you're there like six hours later. Like what? How the fuck? Have, well, not six hours, but you're there. Like how the fuck have I gone from this? <laughs> kind of normal thing to watching like a fat kid fall off a tricycle or some shit like, you know, like what, what baits you in man it? it hooks you yeah it's clickbait you that's fine it's focus and it goes down in yeah, yeah like yeah. alright how to do something <laughs> on editing <laughs> software and then before you know it like, yeah. Yeah, that's what it does you need super focus <laughs> exactly to, yeah to look for actual just to be able to YouTube block out all of the like, the meme and in the entertainment yeah. and just be like right now I came in for this yeah how there's fucking meme colleges now and oh, shit. Really? <laughs> yeah, yeah, Man, like, you can you get, get a degree in meme. I fucking, I'm glad yeah. they exist in that. I just, well, I'm no, surprised. I'm going to Google this shit. I'm surprised they exist, but I'm going to I'm going to find my closest meme college. Memes are sick right now. I love I memes have always been memes. sick, man. Yeah, from the first. Yeah, from the get-go. Whoever, but the, do you right know now, what was sick, bro? It's Vine. <laughs> Yeah, Vine, Vine, Vine started yeah, a lot. Yeah. Vine was yeah. one of the funniest. Like, the and Vine I didn't even. Like the, 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 but I didn't know about gay. Vine when Vine was about. Like, I it's only found. Yeah, yeah, I only found out about it like two years ago or some shit, and just watched all the compilations. Like that, that <laughs> no, guy pronouncing brilliant. things wrong. Yeah. Have you seen oh, that? that's brilliant! Like going through the supermarket, yeah, it's just yeah, like. Yeah. like Potato. <laughs> <laughs> Something weird and just like, like hold up. <laughs> it's just like what the uh, fuck. Mate, this is where I wish we could like live <laughs> well, sh- live stream shit onto the cameras. So just yeah, like you, whatever we're talking about. Do you reckon that's well, still I can edit in. Yeah. I'll edit in the meme of <laughs> Right. Do you reckon that that's still yeah, good? I'll check it actually. Yeah. How, how long have we been rolling for as well? Uh, like, I don't know. Hour and five minutes. I'm still recording. Okay, got an hour left on that one. Checking the camera. And this one's recording off the wall, so that one on me is never gonna get. It's never gonna go, that's what we're Plugged into the wall, so I'll be here the whole time. Plugged in. But right, I guess we should probably bring this back to to music. I should probably ask you guys some more questions. Dig deeper into Yeah, this bottle's kinda fucking Giant out. Fucking what? Right, fucking with the. Right. Well, <laughs> I can't see, yeah, man. My focus. See, this is the thing, man. Like before meeting, I would have loads of questions, and now the cameras are on. I'm like, well, yeah. what, what, like, what can I, what can I ask? That's like skating. That's well, one of the worst things of skating. Like, nah, well, like as soon as you start camera. filming, the camera oh, goes on, yeah, and yeah, you've been yeah, doing right, something all day. Yeah, the yeah. bail gun. That's what I used to yeah. call it. You just literally Same camera comes anything. on. Boom, you can't do it. Mate, I'll do the best scratch of my life and then put the camera on to do it again and it won't happen. Yeah. Never happens. It's fucked. Yeah. Put the camera on, it's like... It's weird, you got to be in the moment, man. Like five years, like... Mm. Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck? That's perfect. Five seconds. Yeah, if you say the advance. <laughs> yeah, yeah. the advance. Is that a word? I do. No, uh, I'm not. trying to figure yeah, out. The yeah. advance. Yeah, it breaks off. Is that it? The advance. The advance. Decrease? De- de- I don't know. I, I'm trying to f- I'm trying to think <laughs> of, of what the advance. Retreat. Yeah. What's the Sean Price bar? There's a Sean Price bar. I don't know what I meant, but I know what I meant when I said it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I shouldn't even question it, bro. It's the fucking, the pink jean. And the Ciroc, the Ciroc's hardly been touched, man. I got oh, that for Blast. Ciroc, yeah. Shout for, shout out to Blast and Abso. 
Yeah, man. They That's killed, the they killed man. the set of the Halloween party. Yeah. They Everyone got man. fucking blast, man. I get bare voice messages off the day. Yeah, 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 he he just drives my energy for the day, bro. Yeah. If, I, yeah. if, you get, if, I, if I get a voicemail, they got blasted it. Yeah, yeah there's no way you fucking... In the morning, like, if I get a voicemail, it comes through in the morning, my day's blessed, man, because he's just like, yo, super, super power love. Yeah, he's a G, man. He's fucking sick. They got blast, man. He's just like unrivaled. Like, but that the way they the way they go though in like the way they the way they do it in America, America brother, is different man. We're, like, we're how, so pessimistic in this country, or, or maybe not pessimistic. It's but, like, not pessimistic. We have a different we're like outlook on the way I look at it is comedy. like comedies, like sitcoms, like British sitcoms versus American sitcoms. The yeah, main characters in American sitcoms they have like this kind of like really positive like outlook, and the characters always get better, like they become better people. Whereas in England you look at shit like. They just right. get murdered. They just, they, well, they get murdered. Or well, they like just, they're just horrible affair, people like, and they stay horrible people. Uh, and they have a hap, like, most of the time, maybe not so much nowadays, but they TV just have... is just there to distract people and, and, and like... Yeah. Yeah, yeah. People's big day. collective consciousness in America is different to England. Yeah, definitely. So they can distract you differently. Like, yeah, it's if they put shit on the telly, like, your neighbour, three doors down, happen. is probably going through, isn't it? Mm. And it brings it like all close to home and then you just... End up going to work and staying in. <laughs> That's the conspiracy. Just sit there and turn yeah. into a vegetable, isn't it? Yeah. I'm glad I'm not like that person on the telly. Really, you're just not doing nothing, but... <laughs> <laughs> you're sat there yeah. watching that person yeah. on the telly going, yeah. I'm glad I'm not that person like that, on the yeah. telly. Like. I'm going to yeah. make a because i got it good and that. <laughs> <laughs> you're not doing nothing. Yeah. yeah, but the mad thing is now people watch people watch telly. Like, shit, like, I'll go watch. Yeah. It's like, what? Well, like, well, sick, though, isn't it? Oh, man, <laughs> I actually got, Google like, books, I won't lie, like, if there's Google nothing else on, it's not, it's not a bad thing to it watch. It started with Big Brother anyway, when they did the yeah, first Big Brother. I, I never, I never got that into that. Like, that was people on it. That was like when we had ETV, like, each went, whoop. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I fun, never really... Like, Watching people on the sofa, yeah. which is actually what we're doing. Anyway. It was but like it was like a social experiment. I swear, man. Just yeah, to like of course it was. Yeah. See how many people are gonna watch people. But I mean, like it's huge. locked in still a house. Is, yeah. Still is. Do you know what I mean? I mean, it's considered trash now, but it's still on. So a lot of people. Trash trash still it's what it's still on now. I think Big Brother on. Big Brother still on. I think yeah, I, I think, think Channel Five bought it. Yeah, yeah no, I think still do it. It's just changed channel. Channel Five bought it. Yeah. I think it's still on. Someone, <laughs> yeah. someone brought it back. Yeah, I like, watch it, but the celebrity one and that I watched. The celebrity one's a little bit more tolerable because yeah, it might be someone you know. Yeah, the celebrity like, one is. To be fair, yeah. the, like the only like reality show I ever watch is like yeah, I'm a celeb, but even now I'm a celeb. But even now I'm like I'm a bit like I don't know. I've seen it this year. Yeah, this year's been. I brought your jacket. You can have a blanket if you want, mate. I'll wrap this uh, one. I'll be alright for a blanket. Dog blanket. Yeah. Just like wrap it. <laughs> Looking like Mother Teresa <laughs> and that. When you, um, Is that alright? When yeah. you wrapped up Blue sure? earlier, it, yeah. like, it kind of looked like she was E.T. Like, when like, yeah, E.T. Yeah, yeah. out the front of the, the bicycle. Blue Z phone home. She's been, that would be, she's been, that would such, she's been the biggest troublemaker, cover. man. Honestly. She's yeah. been like a lack of attention, isn't it? Yeah. yeah, she's been like waking him up. Like, she'll go into the room and just fucking like. Yelp. She doesn't like yeah, her. Yeah, like, yeah. It's not like she, trying to like. No, nah, she's like, smart. Like, do it. Yeah, she knows what's like. Like, I'm not just saying it to be biased because she's my dog. Yeah, yeah, but she's a fucking smart dog, man. She yeah. knows how to get things. Yelp. Like, so the baby wakes up. And yeah. You so up, like, so you like, go like, straight like, there, straight yeah. away. You're just like, oh fuck. Yeah. She's gonna wake the baby up again. Intelligent but bitches, man. At first, it's yes. mad though because at first she was like, she she like loves him. Do you know what I mean? She's yeah. proper gentle yeah, with him. She'll like she'll only like like give him little kisses and shit. She yeah. like but recently she started jumping up and being a bit less Yeah. yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I think it, it's like I don't I've made I've no fucking experience with kids or dogs. It was so yeah. like, <laughs> it's still but early, man. It's I don't so feel like the yeah. advice, but it, like, so it might just be a period. It. Yeah, and no, I reckon yeah. it is. Yeah, we'll settle down with just, Yeah. She's like fat used to that. She's I just feel bad in it. How old is she now? She's uh, 11. Yeah, 11 years old. So what's that, 77? Like, yeah. 77 in dog years. Is it? Yeah. yeah. Seven Bloody years hell. to a year. Like. Bloody hell. She's an old girl. <laughs> 77. Yeah. Yeah, it's mad, man. It's mad how a dog becomes part of your, like, fucking... Yeah, nine years. Yeah, yeah, well, like, years, isn't it? like yeah, 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 fully. It's, it's like really it's different yeah. because nine years by now, dude, should be fucking. 
like, be like wiping her own ass and like doing <laughs> her, you know what I mean? Like, yeah, yeah. Yeah. We'll be putting grass out of it at the fucking, <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. Some of the shit you gotta do. The mad thing with Blue as well is mm. I've never even had any thought of getting a dog. Yeah, what was it that made you? Like, just uh how did you like an old friend of, like a friend of ours who was like basically in a situation where he couldn't look after her mm. you know what i mean and he bumped into bad habits in a park by where bad habits used to live yeah. <coughs> and bad habits had just got his blue <laughs> staffy like yeah, a, yeah. a boy blue staffy and uh my friend marcus was like yeah like do you want her? Do you know what I mean? If you can just mm -hmm. take her, yeah, like yeah, yeah. I don't even care about money. Like if you she's gonna go to, to a good home, to, yeah, yeah. So bad habits yeah. called me and was like, "Yo, do you want a dog?" Because I was kind of, I was like, I was toying with the idea, but I was like yeah, toying yeah, with yeah, it. Yeah, do you yeah, know yeah, what I yeah, mean? Yeah. It wasn't yeah, like that's like the old slap in the face. Like, do you want one or not? It like, was just it was like he was just like yeah, and like him and his missus was just like just do it, do it, do it. <laughs> just like fuck it, and then yeah. Yeah. That was that, you know what I mean. Probably don't. And they've helped out a fucking. They they helped out a lot. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Because there was times when I had to go away and stuff, and I yeah. left her. Like, That's the thing so they've looked after her a lot. But yeah, she's definitely a little part of the family. Definitely, yeah. Well, I won't put, yeah, that's why I was yeah. like, I have to immortalize her. Yeah, hundred. Do you know what I mean? Put her on like a piece of artwork or something, like. Because she was like a little savior, to be honest. Yeah, no, it's a great way to do it, man. Like, I, can't, I don't know there's many people that wrote or have their dog as their album cover. Yeah. Like, there's probably not, not that many people. I don't know. It's not even about yeah, that. It's, it's just no, like, no, but it's like, it's a, but, nice, yeah, it's a yeah. nice devotion, like you said, like immortalizing it. Yeah. But yeah, man. I mean, I'd love to fucking own a house that had a garden so I could have a dog, but I mean. It's, it's, a, it's a lot. It's a big responsibility as well, man. Yeah. It's I mean, like, it's like, not a fucking. Me and my girlfriend have a cat and it stays it's in Spain so I don't like yeah. it yeah. mine's going off then yours is going off I'm just going to put yeah, my own yeah, 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 like, yeah, 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 switch it off but what was I saying um, but yeah no my like me and my girlfriend have had a cat for like six months almost a year and like that's not the same because I don't even see it half the time because mm. it's in Spain but even when I see it it's like a weird like I've never had a pet of my own or like something but you do have a very weird effect like affliction to it mm. and like this weird kind of like it's not a kid in any like in any stretch mm. of the mark so I can't ever compare it to that but it's a weird like responsibility and a cat's so much fucking easier than a dog mate like a dog yeah is, they're independent yeah, cats yeah, are cats, joke, man. Like, cats are they're just, just like yeah thing. Like, I if I feel like getting a stroke I'll yeah. come over and get a stroke yeah, and now I'm going to go out and kill something yeah. gonna kill some and rip mice. it up and like, bring it back to you and be like, hey. Yeah, yeah now give me no. a stroke, motherfucker. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> when I walk exactly. up, I'm going to show my whole ass. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> come and sit, like, like, come and sit joke, on your lap and then just yeah, like yeah, move just, the whole ass in your face. And you're just yeah, like, yeah, they lift up the tail, show you the whole ass. Exactly. Like, yeah. And walk off, like moody. So they, they, they know what they're doing. They know. They're just, just yeah. doing it to spite you. They're savage. Dogs are better, man. Definitely. Yeah. I think I don't know. I'm like the older I get, the more I fucking like get all like, oh man, animals are like they're all the same. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, I mm. don't know, man. Cats are fucking like they're all pretty similar. Like even pigs apparently smarter than dogs. Yeah, yeah, I've heard that. Do you know what I mean? And we I just like pig, I wouldn't we, want a pig. Like, <laughs> it's all right when it's a little piglet, but then when it, what dog, happens when it becomes a full grown pig? pig? Like. Imagine that going up and down the stairs like when you're trying to sleep. It's gonna I'm make not, up I'm loud. Yeah, I'm not trying to. Yeah, it'd be like a fucking. <laughs> it would be like a. Be mad. A greyhound or some shit. You know what I mean? It'd be a big. It'd yeah. be a big dog. fucking thing. Yeah. And that a pig, a proper pig, would be way it'd bigger be than a big dog. That's I'm like a boring. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine? Yeah, man, but no, but they're fucking um, smart. That's so you could train it to like fucking fetch the paper for you <laughs> yeah, and like get a yeah, plant from mad. the fucking. Yeah, if you could teach your. Have a pet, man. Yeah. If you could teach your like your like your pig to like pour a pint, I mean, oh, that would be a, a pig, isn't it? That would be mad. <laughs> like, really but then it wouldn't be able to. It wouldn't be able to do that because it would be right, hoops. And you could train, no, hoops. brother. You could train them to go fucking yeah, shit yeah. in the corner of the garden. That's like saying They're you're clean. flying out of order if you only want a dog. Yeah, but like a pig is gonna like shit. But yeah, your pig are phobic or something. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> what you want? What you only want dogs? What's wrong with you? Dog or a cat? You're fucked, man. I'd have a lizard, maybe. 
a lizard. Yeah, man. Would you ever have a snake as a pet? So you could just lie on it. Yeah, you look after. It. I think you got to look after <laughs> lizards and shit way more than you got to look after like a fucking. Yeah, no, I do my thing, obviously, but. Yeah, guinea pig. Guinea pigs. Are guinea so pigs. Simple. They, don't really they have live for. But if we had guinea they? pigs, yeah, they live for like nine why, years. Why do you want one? Well, yeah, they went blind. Like one oh, of them was fucking had tumors all over it. Why it was would like you obese. want a guinea pig anyway? Oh, I don't know. My sisters had hamsters because we were kids, yeah, but like, they just lived for way too long. They should have died. Yeah, yeah. that's why hamsters, like, hamsters are like eighteen months or something, or like is it? maybe a year, like two years. That's just trauma for a kid, man. Just, yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> just like don't yeah, get him a hamster. Just get him something. That's gonna Mate, my sisters, ages. my sisters got a yeah, hamster. In two weeks, they were like, I don't want it anymore, and we're losing it under the sofa. Like I was just like, Ooh, like you wouldn't, I know yeah, you a girl whose dad down, like, like used to fucking drink a lot, and yeah. like she had about four hamsters, because he just come back pissed up, and just like fucking hoof the thing by accident, like <laughs> kick the cage or whatever, and knock it off the side, Damn. and that the poor little hamster would just have a heart attack, oh, come down in the morning, like, like, Jesus. Yeah, like, yeah I, I shouldn't I laugh feel, at that. I feel bad for the hamsters, mate, because like they. All they ever used to do when they were in the cage was just like hang on, well, the, hang on the top and just fucking try and get out. Yeah. And I felt fucking awful. I'd look at them and be like, "Why do you want that?" Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Fucked, and the What's thing is, the dog? thing is, get like, a dog. Man's best on. friend, isn't it? Exactly. Do, um, let's bring it back in it. What do guinea yeah. pigs do when they're not actually pets? Uh, <laughs> I don't actually know. I don't know. They, they, they probably used to live in like. Do they live in like Papua New Guinea? No. Are they like weirdly bred with another guinea animal guinea or something? Or like they, are they, or are they actually something that's evolved? I only no, know. I think that they, I only know they have to be pets. I don't. Yeah, know. I, I swear they are like a. I swear they are like a fucking. Like a brute, like breed of. Yeah, it's like a rabbit, I suppose, isn't it? Can't, I, I'm where did not, the, I'm not where, where did the guinea Mate, pigs from? I should, well? call, I should call up my friend Caleb. He Mate, knows, fact like, check. Kit. It's open. Oh, it might be closed now. Yeah, I think it's closed. I get my phone. What is what? What is the purpose of a guinea pig? No, no. Yeah, where the they, where the uh, guinea where, pigs yeah. run wild? What do they do when they're not pets? Where do <laughs> what do they do? <laughs> where do they hang out? Like? Yeah, what are they on? Are they on stuff? Uh, <laughs> guinea pigs live in the wild in South America. Yes, yes. living in rocky areas, grasslands, and forest edges. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Imagine keep, that. Like, I know one. I know one guinea why pig name, I and I don't know why. Why did England get guinea pigs? Uh, <laughs> I need to know. This How did England? We got a deep check. Yeah, because like, why guinea pigs? Isn't it? If they're not from here, like, well, well, they brought over enough shit. All of the other episodes that we wanted to fact check, fact check something, we've said it, and we've been like, ah, yeah, exactly. like, no, nah, but now we're actually like yeah, guinea it. pigs. Yeah, exactly. like, all right, this is important. It well, um, it's, it is pretty pump, important. Pump, it's pretty important, yeah, right? Uh, I'm trying to find like how they came to England, yeah, but why, why did well, they, they get them? you know what you should pull up is like a list of no, the things that? that have been brought to England. Like the dip, you know, think how many like different things animals like and shit. Oh, yeah, what is it? Like, or is that too much? Yeah, that's too many. That's too much. We just need to know why that one was. I don't know. I think there, really there, there'd be know. some interesting things. Like I can actually find something. that on my own afterwards. It's all good. Oh uh, yeah, well, well I've, you've made me go. <laughs> the laptop's out now. What's your next moves then? Me. Have you got any uh, music videos lined up? Um, so me and me and Weaver, um, he's got an album coming out with Bailey's Brown. Um, he played me a couple tracks um, from that. It sounds fucking dope. Yeah. There's well, the track that I'm going to do a music video for. Um, it's got these. I might not be exactly right, but it's got these really cool sounding like saxophone or like trumpet kind of like jazzy yeah. samples in. So I want to film like the whole. The whole video kind of like in black and white, but kind of do. Have you seen the film Sin City? Where yeah, it's like, I, I want to kind of want to do something like that, where like, yeah, man. it's all like black, black and white, apart black, from a black, few white. things, like maybe like yeah, a blue yeah. in one shot or like a red. Yeah, it looks nice. I love but the black when it's like pitch black and actually white, awesome, man. Like, you can, yeah. and we could even be like, we the plan was to just kind of not really do anything too Tim special in the, the terms of for that, isn't it? Mad. Just, is it George Miller? Tim? Uh, no, Frank Miller. Frank, Frank Miller. Frank yeah. Miller, man. He's fucking crazy. The second one, did you see the second one? Didn't, me, I didn't watch it. It let me down with it, wasn't it? it? I remember when it came it's, out it's and I got hyped for it. It's good to watch him that, but it's not a good enough continue from what it was, do you know what I mean? I really want to see the um, the, the new Doctor Sleep. 
film. The new Yeah, show. that looks good. But new show Doctor Sleep. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just the fact that he's in it gives me hope. It's pretty joke that he's in that. I love him, mate. For me, he's he's Obi Wan Kenobi. Growing up, Obi Wan Kenobi. Stop, mate. But mate, when I I am not defending the prequels. The prequels are shit, but. I was a Harry kid. Was I was Kenobi, five yeah. years old. When he got picked to be Obi Wan Kenobi, I already yeah. thought he was a dickhead from before. That. Oh mate, I'm not saying Obi Wan Kenobi is his like. He did train spotting. Well. Yeah. It's different he's, times though, isn't it? Different train times. Spotting. Train spotting was good, mm. and then after that, I was just like, nah, I, actually, this guy's a prick. I don't, I don't know. know. <laughs> <laughs> like if I, I had to sort of, yeah. Yeah, everybody has different opinion, man. Like, and then people. everything after that, I was like, how is he gonna be in Star Wars? Fuck all the way. Off yeah. Like, yeah, I don't know. The worst character in that was fucking Jar Jar Binks, man. That oh, was some oh, fucked oh. up shit. Jar Jar like, Binks ruined what the What are you thing. doing? It took fucking Fuck. years to get to that film, didn't it? <laughs> it was like 20 years or some shit to get to that film. Yeah. And then Jar Jar Binks ruined the whole thing. <laughs> On some fucked up shit as well, like yeah, whoa. Instead of like, pitching to the fans, they tried to get like a new young generation. Yeah, mate, they like, they they like abandoned. Like, I don't even want to say because I'm not. I wasn't alive when the original. They hit abandon. I don't feel. I but like no, but the, the the new ones, like the new Star Wars films. I feel it's like it's bought by Disney, aren't it? Yeah, it's yeah, I mean, to Disney now. Disney. Got to the point where Disney is got to Disney. Have you seen the South Forest, like Mickey Mouse, like being up, like Disney? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 oh man! Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, that is Disney. Disney will soon rule the world, like in uh-huh. video or media company. I don't know. You reckon that's the way Disney it's going? Fox. Do you reckon there's just going to be like a few, like yeah. four? Yeah, yeah, four yeah. companies or some shit. It'll, just it'll, like, well, look at the, like, the way it's already going. You've got like Apple Plus, you've got Disney. Worth, yeah. Worth. Yeah. Disney Plus, I don't know what the fuck shit. Yeah, like Apple will buy out Netflix or some shit and then it will yeah. just turn yeah. into like this big. I don't know if they'll buy out, they'll just try they and buy create out a Netflix. rival. No, they will. No. But the they're already is... trying it with, with the Spotify thing. Yeah. Apple, well, Apple, 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 Apple and, and Spotify. Spotify. Yeah, Apple have employed that one guy, in it? That one no, guy. One guy. <laughs> basically, no, no, there's one guy that set up the whole purpose of like, no, not even the whole purpose, the whole thing of like, how everyone can upload their stuff to Spotify, yeah. Yeah. You just join the distribution thing, pay your fee for that, and it will. You can put your own stuff on there. Yeah. So that guy, yeah, Apple's employed him. He's the guy that got all that shit popping for Spotify. Right. Um, okay. So I think people's everyone, everyone right now as well, isn't it? They're all putting their energy into Spotify. Yeah. He's the only one. Like mm-hmm. when you're on Spotify, if you're on a if you're on a thing, you're on Apple, you're on Tidal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just from the fact you're on one of them, and then you're on all of them. Right? Nah, that depends nah, you on your distribution deal, surely. Nah, 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 all the distributors, nah, nah, all of them put you on there. Dist- yeah, that, yeah, but How every dis- every distribution deal will put you on there. But say you I were to know, sign up to there's Spotify. Three, there's three companies, isn't it? You can go. The one I know the name of properly is DistroKid, mm-hmm. and you pay your uh, whatever the fucking fee is. Like, I think it's like twelve pounds for a year or some shit. It's mad cheap. Yeah, that's pretty affordable. For yeah, yeah, but you pay it to there, and mm-hmm. then it puts you on Spotify, Apple, Tidal. Blah, so blah, they blah. handle like all, all of the legal. Yeah, it's, it's digital, digital, digital distribution, basically. Yeah. Yeah. What yeah. everyone's doing anyway, basically, mm-hmm. everyone's forgetting all that shit. Yeah, everyone's working on their Spotify because it says all the numbers on Spotify. Yeah, twenty-one thousand listeners a month. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Twelve listeners a month. Whatever yeah, the yeah, fuck yeah. it is, isn't it? Well, so everyone's focusing on that, but I yeah, think yeah. the next wave is going to come from Apple mm. and TikTok, they, mate. You got to get TikTok. Employed, I just they're not going to destroy that guy for no reason. Yeah, yeah. the leap. Yeah, you're right. That social media thing. They're not going to. The little, guy my sister no uses that, but I've never fucking. Mm. Even, if I'm talking about the same TikTok. Yeah, yeah. 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 I've never even like touch that like but that's the new wave i'm behind man and i'm saying it like a, I'm, I'm old I'm, I see the name like I, I, so like weird. i listened to some shit the other day as well over for like i can't remember some something billion all right people have downloaded it what is it that can't be right like sixth of the world maybe maybe it was a video it was it was some crazy fucking figures yeah but i think it's going to be the new wave like all the like all Hey, I sound fucking old. It's peak, <laughs> but like the young, yeah, yeah, but the I, kids I, I, nowadays. I know, but that's the thing. That's even I see that. Yeah, right? I look at my sisters well. and the social media that they use and, and shit like that. Like, 
I'm like just Facebook and Instagram normally for me. I don't fuck with Snapchat really. I don't really. But then they're like, oh, have, you, have you heard of all this yeah. stuff? And like, and I'm like, what the fuck is? What is this? Yeah. Like, so you know, for people like I'm not saying you're old guys, but you know, for people who are like your generation, it must be like well, yeah. hard to fucking keep on top of it, especially if you're trying to sell your music or sell your company or sell your product or whatever it is. Which is interesting. It's just interesting because yeah. say say with like what the product that we make is I don't know, it's pretty like if you get fans, mm. I feel like those fans will be if, if you you're not a fucking cunt if you or, and you like do you know what I mean? You you're consistent. Yeah. Then yeah. those people will yeah. stick with you wish, like yeah. if, if you can build up just a like a supporter rather than a, a fan yeah like, of course you know, yeah that, like I think like, like how the way he said it was people that you know they buy your t-shirts they buy your hoodies yeah, they go to support it. It. Yeah. Yeah. yeah and like there's people like that that there's people like that that like, I do business with who still fuck like shouts to Rachel Wiltshire yeah I know yeah like she supported like she supported Fatty New and I'm so fucking far away from the mic yeah. she supported hard man and and she's supporting the scene as well by doing what she does with the nights and yeah, stuff. Yeah, I filmed whole. a couple of uh, of, of the of the nights. Um, to be fair, I've been long with a fucking after movie for the second one. Yeah, we need that after movie for the Halloween night as well. Coming, bro. Sorry to coming, put bro. business on camera, but no, 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 yeah, that's, that's, yeah. that's coming. When like, so, give me a deadline. Give me a day because I'm not working tomorrow. Now. A day. Tomorrow. Well, to <laughs> be fair, <laughs> uh, to be fair, actually, tomorrow yeah, is tomorrow. a good opportunity. I've, like, well, normally it's Saturday. Now you got till Monday. No, nah, normally. Okay, well, I'm gonna be nice. Okay. You can see. Well, I got what's the, pod- <laughs> the podcast, <laughs> podcast and the fucking oh, but good Hall- bad uh, yeah. Halloween. But yeah, it does look beautiful. I will say it. Yeah. All of the shots are really nice. Right, Saturday yeah. then. Yeah, Saturday. <laughs> nah, now, like, let's say ne- let's say uh, next like. Thursday. Cool. The next oh, Friday, no just before next nothing, weekend so, or something. Yeah. yeah. Before we film the next one. Mm. Yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 Awesome. yeah. But um, yeah, no, yeah, I'm I'm excited to drop that. That's gonna be, it's gonna be really good. Real good. Is your like focus to fully get into shooting music videos then, or is it? Do you um, want to go down the path of like what you was doing when you was younger, yeah, directing, really like, film, and? It's all a bit kind of up in the air like I don't I don't really know I mean music videos are great because they don't necessarily have to have as much planning and preparation as, and money to make like a, a, a really nice well written short film yeah. um, but and the, the other thing as well is music videos you can just kind of get really weird with and you can experiment loads with whether it be editing or the way you film something yeah but B-roll. Um, I mean the end game is always going to be like a feature film but that's obviously really unlikely and it? it takes so many steps to get there that it's a goal but it's not something that I can obsess over like now it's just kind of focus on what you want to do like I, I want to try and get more in touch with Ollie Ollie Whitehouse yeah and try and see. I've met he's him been talking about times. doing a, a film for a long time as well but it's yeah, one of those things that I think it's the same thing, thing it's such a long like, process I'm, I'm so jealous of Tommy man because like he's written something I read like it's a fucking good script Mm. and he's got um, someone producing his film he goes to the same uni and he's really like switched on and I think if if ever he, he was doing auditions today and like even just that like I kind of got jealous of because I've never I've never held a proper professional audition yeah. yeah have actors come in and read for you like the lines that you've written that's to me that's really cool yeah and it's, it, it, you both seem very professional do you know what I mean like you've both been we're both very similar professional in that way. With, yeah like I can see I can see him holding know that what we want to like go into yeah and like Shout, shouts to Tommy man because like yeah, big up it was him. it was nice having him as part of the team do you yeah, know what I mean yeah he but, did a fucking like a big up him because there was a lot of shit like especially on the audio side that yeah. he kind of got me to like wrap, wrap my head around and sort of like explain it to me and like because otherwise, if if it had been just me doing it, I mean, I might not still be here. Like, yeah. Things might have got so out of hand that yeah. it just blew up in my face. Yeah. So, you know... He, it is he, essential he, to he the respects, essential respects to the setup. To him. Yeah, 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 straight. You can always um, pass me the audio as well. If you yeah, that's the other thing, man. Like, I, there might be maybe on the editing side, because yeah. there might be, like, moments where I'm like, I don't know how to, like, fix it or whatever. But, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but, um... Yeah, uh, features are always the goal, but until then, 
I just need to start writing. Like, yeah. I'm really annoyed. What, writing I'm, scripts? Writing scripts, yeah, because I had... It's, kind of annoying. it's annoying that I got sacked from the bar because I had an idea centred around the bar and I was just like, oh, fuck, that's... that's there was like I said to him like if I if I write something for here like can I use this as a location he's like yeah no problem mate and then no, no, no longer work there so it, I don't know if that will work quite so nicely but there's plenty of bars around yeah, Bristol and shit though but you could easily it's just sort of it out. out it's Stag and Hound to be fair they they you can hire that out to shoot I know yeah. that Old friends market. friends did a shoot shoot there once. But I feel like I'm in the right place. Like the university that I go to, um, it's really small and it does kind of feel like a bit of a cult sometimes. Like the type of what, people. What within yeah, the people that go there, yeah. Yeah, like it's a, it's a nice place and everybody's like a, on the same like goal. Like they all want the same thing. Everyone's open to helping each other. But like, I'm not chatting any bad about fucking screenology. I hope they don't fucking yeah. see this. But <laughs> there, there are some people there that they obviously are so wound up and what they're doing that they don't really have a moment to think like wait what if I'm not the next fucking um, Quentin Tarantino what if I'm literally like you know like everybody else here just a kid that kind of like wants to do it but yeah. it has to be humble like there are a lot they're of people not, they're not thinking about the they're, B, C, D, E, F, like, G they're it's thinking like about Y and Z like. it's like what? it's like a handful it's not everybody but it's just it's like I don't know it's sad to see like I remember once I was booking stuff out for, for this for the podcast someone asked me what I was doing I was like oh, I'm filming, filming a podcast like free cameras and explain the setup and stuff and he, he said to me why don't you buy it and I, I was like what like, how much money do you think I have like I wanted to say something I don't have a trust fund <laughs> like, but, just but, buy a free fucking but, like, like, it's like the light bit the lights alone <laughs> that we're using costs like probably a few like 800 quid maybe yeah. or like to get good powerful lights shouts to uni yeah, yeah. screenology yeah. For <laughs> screenology for fucking but um yeah I think it's a good place because I'm I've been there two months or give or take and I've made like four projects mm. already and um one of them was a music video actually to be fair are you coming out of this shit with mad debt like are you like how much how much it's is gonna it be, it's going to be a lot yeah it's going to be around the chat 50 yeah but 60 but the it's interesting is, I was speaking to my friend today yeah at work uh, Freddie yeah and he went to uni he mm -hmm. did the whole thing mm -hmm. yeah and now he's just got like a job or he had a job just before he came to this job where he started earning enough to pay it back yeah, and all he has to pay back 25, a month, twenty five k. Yeah. yeah, all he has to pay back a month is nineteen pound fifty. Stupid. For the rest of his life. Yeah. Well, thirty years. After thirty years, yeah. That's what I well, I hope it's true. I remember reading that somewhere. Yeah, maybe it was. Yeah. Like, Fuck off to Australia or something. Fuck the tax man. That's not get me now. But, no, I don't want to say it. Hard pressed to get into Australia nowadays, mate. Is True. It? Yeah. You got to fucking yeah. like marry someone or be a doctor. Mm, fucking. All right. Well. Uh, I'm an expert like at filming fucking... podcasts, so yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, I don't know if that's a skill that's on their like criteria. But what were, what were we talking about? Um, he sparked the zoot and just forgot. No, no, I haven't even had it. I haven't even, had a, I haven't even drawn it yet. Yeah, it's already hit you. What were we talking about? That's like when you <laughs> might <laughs> even fucking. You ever have it like where you go to build up a zoot and you haven't like blazed all day or whatever, and yeah. as soon as you smell the grade, you want to take a shit. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, well. it's it's the morning yeah. ones. Yeah. yeah. It's like the cup of tea, cup of tea and the split, and, and then you're like, all right. Yeah, coffee's, coffee's the direct. Shit's moving. Shit's moving. Brown army, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> smoking is a natural chopping direct. Chopping off bungles fingers. <laughs> Trot the kids off at the pool. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. That's why chopping off bungles fingers. <laughs> <laughs> what was that one? I've never heard that one before. Yeah, bungle from Rainbow. Nah. Nah. Uh, I don't even know who Bungle is, it's man. He's a big brown bear and all of his fingers look like poo. <laughs> <laughs> like fingers, isn't it? <laughs> Old school man, I forget that. <laughs> That's it. I fucking, I forget half the fucking like, references and jokes I'm told, man. It's fucked. Mm. And then I remember it at like a random time when I'm on my ones yeah, or something. And just be like, oh yeah, that's pretty funny. Like, <laughs> like, like laugh to myself. Or something and then yeah, just, yeah. Like, mm. And then just walk out and I'm like, oh shit, yeah, I've got to go and get some fucking soup. 
Oh, I remember <laughs> some. I was watching a clip of like some stand-up comic, and he was talking about how he watched um, one of Dave Chappelle's things. Well, I think it was. I think it was. He was talking about Dave Chappelle, and he was like, "What was the hardest thing like you could like do, or like to show that you're gangster or something?" Like, I don't know where I heard this for the life of me. I'm probably going to explain it terribly, <laughs> but forgive me. Um, and he was like, "What's the hardest like gangster shit you could do?" So like, so people when they look at you, you're like well fuck I'm not gonna go near that guy and it was like you could like grab like a knife or some shit and like you chop your dick off and you say like Wu-Tang motherfucker <laughs> and this guy didn't get it and he was like thinking about it like he didn't find it funny and yeah. then it hit him like a couple of days later yeah, I think guy, he was in an yeah. elevator and there was a guy affiliated with Wu-Tang and who actually, who chopped, actually his chopped his dick yeah, off and now true. I remember where it is is fucking That's an facts. interview with RZA and he's talking yeah. about it and he's I think it's like Sway in the Morning or something the guy like was that. addicted to sex bro yeah so he, jumped out, he jumped out of the window didn't he uh, is that the same way? I thought he chopped his own dick off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He got rid of his dick. Yeah. <laughs> and then, but he that's the thing. Off, he didn't <laughs> get it. He didn't get the joke. And then he got that's it. The and then problem. he was just surrounded by people. He didn't change his out mental laughing. state enough, and he chopped his whole dick off. That's hard, no problem. Like, that's, Sorry like, to the that's, guy. That's 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 jumped out a window. Now, fair play, because now he's doing stand up comedy and he's like, yeah, yeah. But wow, he's smashing it. He's doing his thing, man. <laughs> but I know this sort of thing might do it that's why you guys smoke angel that stuff <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that's like one of the main reasons because you start like chopping off body parts or like trying to headbutt through imagine, fences and shit imagine Ooh. how high you got to be <laughs> to do that yeah, yeah man but some of the new things like spice and that I swear people spice go on the mothers yeah it's mother. like angel does yeah, yeah no, it's it's some of the shit that's laced you guys terrible like, for it man Hey, people drop dead in the bear pit like two people died in the bear pit yeah that was peak it's probably why it got all fucking shut down yeah, and like a nah, bit no, like there was too much at the time there was, so, well, but they the, let that happen you know they, 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 they the cancelled out PRSC the skaters, yeah, when the skaters are scared bro, that's when you got a problem in the bear pit the skaters were scared of the fucking I don't know nah they were was man there was people getting whacked up for no reason and just they got mad in the bear pit innit yeah uh, when it was left oh, alone for ages and it was tagged the fuck up. I'm pretty fucking high, man. To I'm be high, fair. high, to be honest, yeah. I'll have a little go, I see. Yeah. Maybe if it's coming this side of the table. Sure is that. <laughs> I don't have to lean no way. <laughs> <laughs> you did not work. That's why you didn't want it, because you didn't want me. It's that. Uh, yeah, maybe another drink. One last drink. No, the bad tape got crazy. Let's go check the cameras one minute. So, oh. Yeah, College Green used to be f the fucking. Old, yeah. They used to be. Yeah, we, we digressed off of that, man. Old Bristol, like. It wasn't just those like, coffee. Oh, uh, yeah, like, we college, fully digressed off of yeah, that. Yeah, College Green back then was fucking like. Like, all places were right. College Green was fucking <laughs> wild, bro. Yeah, all places were right. I remember going right. there, yeah. Cannons Marsh and that back in the day, remember Cannons Marsh? Cannons Marsh? Yeah. It's at the end of, like. It's where fucking. At Bristol or whatever it is now. Oh yeah, what when it was all it was all boarded dead. off. Yeah, just yeah, boarded yeah, off. Yeah. used to come down there and do their fucking displays in the cars. Yeah, yeah. 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 Little display in it, like free donuts and spin out. <laughs> that used to happen down by um do you remember the steelworks in Bedminster? Just like when you come out of Bedminster Station, you go under the bridge. Bedminster you, Station, and you, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and you take a left. On by and now it's all boarded up. Yeah, yeah, and it's empty. Yeah, yeah, but there used yeah, to be like yeah, steel yeah. works there. Yeah, it used to be a yeah. car park thing, innit? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And they used to fucking park up there as well. That was about Mr. Space man. man. When I was like 12, I used to have a fucking. And like, Showcase Cinema as well. Showcase, showcase yeah. Cinema was another one. Like, I used to hang about with Showcase yeah, with about four Asian kids. Right, and we used to have these fucking. We used to go to Madhouse in the galleries. Madhouse, like yeah. Pound for a shirt, innit? Yeah. 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 Like, shirts, yeah. Like, my checkered shirts. Um, all of these used to have a fresh one each week. I go outside the um, sh uh, showcase, just trying to draw girls, innit? <laughs> I'm a madhouse man. Yeah. I swear that one shop has just been like, what is it now? It's is it the like the same, same thing, thing but for cosmetics or something? Name. Yeah, yeah. Because it was closed for time. It yeah, changed yeah, name, it changed yeah. name, it changed name. It's still Madhouse the same was thing. The one, that was the and then it turned to like, I swear now it's like cosmetics or something. Yeah. It's like shampoo, just like hundreds and hundreds. Galleries is fully dead now, isn't it? Yeah, 
Cabot Circus Cabot's is not fronted. even popping either. Cabot's whack as well. Like, if you come to Bristol from Manchester or Liverpool, <coughs> or something, I forgot and you come that's look just at the shops, like, it's whack. It's not even harsh, but. No, it's straight, yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, to be, but it, um, to be fair, it's like it's sippable. Oh, okay. It's sippable. Never, never had Ciroc, so Sorry. I don't know what I'm getting into. Ciroc. No, it's like Ciroc mango, so it's pretty soft. I just made it look difficult. Yeah. yeah that's, that's a good nice one. So. It's sippable. <laughs> it's sippable. Oh. It's quite nice, actually. It's joking, um, Flatbush mm. in New York. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really want to go to Flatbush. Well, that was fucking sick. I really want to like go. The first time we yeah. stayed in New York was in yeah, Flatbush. Yeah, I want to go all of them places, isn't it? Not yeah. just Flatbush, but yeah, I spoil them. Yeah, it's, it's fucking sick, man. And to be fair, like, I had, like, before I went to New York, yeah, I had a dream that fucking cops shot me. <laughs> when I got to the States, like, I was, I was proper pranging about guns and shit and just thinking, yeah. like, we're staying in yeah. the hood, like, what, you know what I mean? Because, like, all I've seen is fucking <coughs> films and, That's like, I don't, thing, yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? I don't know, I've never you, been there. You get, like, almost a, you know I mean? a, a bias, not a bias, but, like, a, a, a tainted idea of what it's going to uh, be like because of, like, movies. And, yeah. yeah. And, and every, everyone we met, bro, was, like, bless. Yeah. Like we did get put on Same shouts to lifelong, mm-hmm. and like Matt Motion and the people that that yeah. put us on to a lot but of people. But even when we were walking around on our ones, yeah. just like yeah, filming yeah, exactly. and yeah, fucking. Yeah, exactly. Well, it's it's always gonna be like we're gonna hear about the minority of people who fuck it up and are assholes with guns and shit, rather than I'm not saying that I agree with no, that gun on America. Right. But there's gonna be a lot of people who own guns or people who don't own guns. They're gonna be silent. They're yeah, there's a lot of places we were at as well, and Liggy, yeah, Liggy was, was like, "Bro, yeah, five years ago you wouldn't have been here." Yeah. yeah. As well, do you know what yeah. I mean? So there's that. Well, that there's visit, gentrification like, has changed is, it a lot is, as well. One of those things as well. Proper Brooklyn gentrified. Like, 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 like I've never been to Brooklyn. Williams, bro. You couldn't bring American rappers here to St. Paul's in in the you know like late. No, nah, but like it's, early it's the same here. Like mid to late night is, you could never get pilled, isn't it? Yeah, it's we're talking about America, like it's. Yeah, yeah. Do you no, know it's what I mean? It's, 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 it's the same thing here. Do you know what I mean? It's just like, on a, on a, on a world yeah. scale, isn't it? That was interesting, like for me as well, because I remember uh, crazy in both Turo, like talking about that, like talking about like yeah. different places in Bristol that, like years ago, you, you know, you wouldn't have wanted to go in. You'd probably now you just get, get hustled, mm-hmm. isn't it? But like when I like days after I moved here, probably twenty years later, whatever from that that period yeah. it was St Paul's Carnival which was the day after my birthday so a big fucking weekend for me but like I imagine if like if I was here 20 years ago that might not have been something that I I don't know I don't know what it would have been like then no, you it would have right. been sound but like yeah, it's the same walking Bristol's through St like, Paul's or whatever like I mean you'd, you'd probably go just, before it got dark but yeah but what I mean is it's just like, know, like something that like even walking around Bedminster I take for granted like that I'm not going to very unlikely to get mugged or I'm not saying everybody walking down the street back then was going to get mugged or whatever I'm not just but like nah. you said car crime yeah. was the highest car crime then. car crime was next car level was, yeah but and like street robberies didn't really start happening until like no but they did in town street mm. robberies was always in town but yeah that's what I'm saying but like town. it wasn't such like it, it got mad and then it got cut off because you get fucking five years for yeah. aggravated burglary yeah, yeah. yeah. Do you know what I mean? It got yeah. like real hot, and no, especially you could, ago, like, well, but yeah, yeah. But like, I don't know. it's just interesting to hear about because obviously I've come to Bristol so much later, and it's almost not impossible to imagine. I'm sure if I go back to Exeter forty years ago, there'd probably be some dodgy shit that I don't know. It, there is dodgy shit that goes on in Exeter everywhere, right now. Everywhere, yeah, man. Everywhere, like everywhere, a hundred percent. Everywhere's got its like areas of like yeah. fucking trouble and areas that are cool like the, got its <laughs> the thing with Bristol is it's just changed so quick yeah and it's probably yeah. it might be the same everywhere else we did but I was talking about this before though it's like I swear there's like a I didn't mean to try and get deep for that but <laughs> there's like a fucking collective consciousness of Bristol yeah so like when I went to Brom last mm. week the whole vibe was different yeah the way people move and the way people just on stuff all the time and the way they come together and like all sorts of things that, yeah. that makes things move forward yeah, yeah. like it was just plain to see yeah. and I was out of town do you know what I mean yeah, so yeah. I was spotting it or whatever and the thing about Bristol is it's just super relaxed isn't it 
yeah that's the main consciousness of Bristol is super relaxed so like if you think of that on a music scale that's why only certain things ever pop up there's only like two three four things that have popped out of Bristol that have been super big isn't it? yeah but well, because everyone's just I fucking think, chilled I think it, yeah I think so everyone's <laughs> just mm, like I yeah think, I think so bro because Birmingham's chilled man everyone's on the same like you go to Birmingham innit? you meet people they're the same type of people whatever there's no problem you just, yeah, you're, yeah, you're, yeah. you're cool with them it's completely but when you walk around Birmingham the next uh, the next day I walked around with Percy and I just walked around all, a few estates and that and I was like yeah the whole atmosphere is different mm. like the whole the architecture's a bit more mm. fucking brutal and like those type of things but I just think the relaxed thing in Bristol is what stops it from popping in a way but it's one of the factors to it one of the factors to it a, a big one yeah yeah yeah, it's interesting, man. You might be right. Like, I mean, mindset. I've had I've heard a lot of people say mindset, like bro. the Bristol trap as well. Yeah, the Bristol trap because you get so because it, it's so Bristol. small but still big. If you can go over, out and do something like every every night of the week. Yeah, yeah. yeah. every yeah. night of the week. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that for me was like yeah. as a yeah. student, one of the attractions coming from somewhere like Exeter. Yeah, like, Exeter. You go out on a Tuesday night, fucking have, yeah, have a, have a nice time. Yeah. You go to like maybe the local like club timepiece and listen to fucking Shakira on repeat, whatever. <laughs> no, because it's yeah. a night every single day. Yeah, yeah exactly. Like, yeah. Going on, man. like run same. every Tuesday. Yeah, it used to be really every same. Tuesday, and it was like the most popping fucking drum and bass night Lumbers in Bristol. Yeah, native, isn't it? Yeah, back when it was at Native, bro. Yeah, just, 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 that was the I got some fucking good memories yeah, man. of that place. Native man. was just a sick club anyway, like. Yeah. Stuff. There was some good hip hop nights there. I remember Coast put on Only Built For. Yeah. That was his night. That was when he was in. Before, right. yeah, I remember that. All right, listen, this is uh, bef- pre fucking Central Spills. He was in a crew called Nothing Long. And it was him, Little Dan. I think I was DJing Li- for them. Little Dan, not Little Dan Skater, Little Dan, no. No, Graft. Um, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's true. Yeah, that was a long time ago. But yeah, that was the first, uh, pre-Central Spurs. It was a, a crew called Nothing Long. Nothing Long. That was Coast's first thing, I think. What's going on with SW? Uh, they've got the Aru up, innit? It's, yeah. yeah it's but right. when, when's, when's it dropping? I think, like, when's new, it? I think New Year they're going to do it. They have to do it New Year now, innit? It's new fucking year. sick. You know about that? No, I'm not familiar. I've got a show now, innit? You have? Yeah. But you secured it? Yeah. It's been secure from ages. I had one on the last one as well. Yes. <laughs> I'm in there, bro. Yeah. So that's, right. that's, that's someone I should get to know. That's the Swear FM, man. Yeah, yeah. South, Southwest. Yeah. I can't even know what the U stands for. Southwest. Do I imagine if I type in on YouTube or Google? Yeah. Southwest Underground. Yeah. Basically, it's yeah. Coast and, uh, and a couple of other guys. So I don't know that either as well. Yeah. yeah actually, Put us on the spot. <laughs> like, that's no, bad. Disrespect yeah, can you. Fact let's fact check, check that actually, man, nah, because nah, I don't want to let that roll. Nah, bef- I don't want to disrespect them. Yeah. 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 I, I can't remember the names of them. Yeah. Oh, it's your shit. <laughs> um, I've, I've forgotten wearing your jacket. Yeah, if anyone wants to buy this. Yeah, it's a like, now. on a real level. Will it be SW.FM? Hit up Rogue. SWU.FM. Because yeah. he wants to sell it. Yeah, the jacket's bad. Look at that. The there. jacket is bad. Whew. How warm is it, man? It's nice, it's Super warm. Cozy, it's cozy. <laughs> I feel comfortable. It's. <laughs> What's his name? Ben Drury. Ben Drury. Ben Drury, Drury Design. No wax in that. It is hard, man. To be fair, like, how much you selling for? I don't know. Whatever's worth, that. it's rare, isn't it? So, like five bills and. <laughs> should like I be wearing bills. it? Two bills, at least. Two bills, yeah. I think you should fucking put in your offers. It's like, <laughs> can you imagine doing that, like live? What putting in live like, sales? Ten bills of like putting the comments. T- sell it. Uh, like tele sales. Yeah. You could do that if Fuck, you had a live stream. You had a lot of people. You could like literally auction off. Be so crazy. <laughs> No, nah, but just, I got a one thousand here. I got a two thousand there. Yeah, can you imagine though, like doing it on like a big well, fucking? Yeah. Before we go into the into the live one, yeah. You have to let if you leave the comments on, it's gonna go mad. Yeah, well, cool. we can like, but that's, that's yeah. the thing yeah, as well. If we start doing it live, people can ask questions. Yeah. People can. That's that's yeah, yeah. that's no, that's that's, that's, that's the goal. Yeah, that's the goal. I want I want it to be like a live chat. If we can, if we can find a way of like 
We're if, sift if we through that. Work, it, it, it might not even be that. It might be like one person. Sorry. No, no, go yeah, on, go nah, on. you carry on. You carry on. I was gonna right. say if we can like live stream, but also if, like I said earlier, into the live stream, like cut things in, or if we had a project, like something we could project there, so that you yeah. guys can all watch it, and then like on the actual stream, it it would go to that like full screen. I think we need to like, that's like if we had that's research. It, that's long in the future. Yeah, so I think we'd have to not have it. Vis- on the cameras like, I reckon we'd have to have it like yeah I don't know but somewhere some, else some way that you can see it cut and, onto and, the screen yeah, yeah, yeah and yeah. also like the people who are watching it can see it's what fu- you're seeing I it's don't funny know. how this shit's it become be like shit to do with like you might not have the rights to show it or something yeah. so there might be issues with that because like, like music is something that always comes up like, if you haven't got the rights to show it just pitch it down <laughs> Yeah, if it knows the music, if people do that with movies, they won't recognise it. It's fine. Yeah, sure. Fuck you. Wrong camera now, though, they know. Now I know that's a sample, bro. Certain people get fucked for that, though, man. Yeah, I never told you to do it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, don't do that. It's not a move. Although everyone does it. Yeah. So you'll be alright. So carry yeah, it. Don't do it, but like you totally can do it. But like you can, but it. you shouldn't. Don't yeah, what? You shouldn't do it, but like you totally can. Totally, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you really can. I'm not gonna say that you should, but like you we do totally not condone. We're, we're not condoning it. Yeah. But you can do it. But yeah. Quite easily. <laughs> Just opened up a loophole. For <laughs> Just keep going round in that circle. Now you can do it. So. <laughs> I've seen the same girl 17 times <laughs> well, there's three since the end of that I got halfway through it yesterday and I got, like, that's, the brilliant. that's my shit. favourite one to do so far it oh. kills me man we do need to do part two that's the, the thing is I wish I we could do this shit every day like, I wish you could right. <laughs> if we could have a daily one it would be sick it would be Daftus like stop drinking yeah. oh yeah uh, and uh, alcoholics but within right. a year like, yeah. we'll be able to or never stop life. drinking <laughs> <laughs> But what happens when you get to like a hundred and you want to celebrate? Yeah. Oof, like when you hit a hundred and you want to celebrate, how do you celebrate when you Stop drink drinking. on every episode? Of day? <laughs> Stop drinking, yeah. yeah, for one day. Yeah, um, I guess so. Treat yourself. Twelve hours. Nah, it's not about that. But it's it. To be fair, like the the ones with um, Blast and Springer, I didn't even drink. No, no, I, I love that one. So that one was yeah, so yeah. funny. To be fair, it's nice. Yeah, to, like yeah. I, I like. I like it, but today has been a it's been a long day. It's been stressful, yeah. but uh, to be fair, man, I think this has gone alright. We've tried about some interesting shit. No, we it's haven't like, even gone gone on to conspiracies yet. Like we haven't even <laughs> had to tap into that barrel. Go to us. You say conspiracy, and then I'll, and then I'll react. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> fucking hell, mate. Well, you can obviously go for the obvious ones, or you can try and find like a more obscure one, like. JFK was he killed by the government or was he 100% killed? obviously yeah. the next one next one <laughs> we've already talked about the moon landing was crazy of course fucking what about the American government using fucking LSD on their soldiers during the Vietnam War yeah I've seen the video yeah no flat earth flat earth that's that's just, we, we, we're it. all on a common understanding <laughs> that that's bollocks fuck off. that shit flat is flat not earth. in fact the only, the only thing I've got to say about flat uh, earth is if you ever meet a flat earther, you should 100% punch him square Two in the nose. Yeah. yeah. I think I... That's crazy shit. I think I just... Like, we don't ages. agree with that, obviously. No, no, I don't know. I don't no. mean it. I mean, just give them a hug and tell them that they're right. But I just have to question them on it. Like, just watch them collapse. <laughs> nah, I reckon you're right, bro. Don't have to Fuck that. It. Punch no, him square no, in the no, face. Like, just way. directly. Punch him or hug him. Whatever in between the eyes. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. If you're not feeling it on that day and your arms a bit sore or whatever, yeah, you've been... Like, just, just, yeah. So nice, long hug. Because we don't agree. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty peak, though. Yeah, no, nah, But fuck that, it what other conspiracies? I, want, I, want some good ones. I got a good one. I got the fucking good one actually. I was talking about this today. Paul McCartney okay. died 
in like 1972 or some shit. <laughs> no, we didn't. Yeah, yeah, listen, listen. Listen, 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 yeah. listen, listen. This is yeah. one I need to pull up, bro. No, we didn't. Yeah, listen, listen, he did, bro. He, that, that, obviously, I don't... I, Clonin. I don't <laughs> believe this. Shine, yeah, shine but it's a good shine. one. It's a good one. You got... Nah, you, this, okay. this one's yeah. actually worthy. It's okay, got right, like... Right, right. I'm interested. So apparently, I think it's George Harrison yeah. recorded this tape, yeah? Yeah. And it's this tape of him talking about how I think night I I don't wanna get it. I'm yeah, get it out. I butcher let's it. Get it but let's, yeah, let's all right, this, cool. Let's get this. Let me I mean there's Paul McCartney actually John Lennon. Nah, 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 but like all sorts of people come into it and Paul that Paul McCartney's still alive now, man, what are you on about? Yeah, he is. Nah but no, 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 no. I don't understand how this could be. Nah, mate, honestly. Okay, okay, I want to hear this. Okay. Like, obviously, 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 yeah, this is just a fuck. Like, don't start thinking I am back in this. Like, don't <laughs> think that I am fully behind this in any way. It's purely for comical want, yeah. fucking value, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 100%. I am with you now. Trust me, Paul McCartney is dead. Yeah, maybe I like that. Right. Shall I read it? Shall I yeah, read it out? Well, Shall I read it out? Yeah. Wait, move slightly back from the mic. This is hitting my red. Just hit So, uh, okay, I'm, I'm, I'll move oh, this way a little bit. Is yeah, it still yeah, hitting red? So we're good. Cool. All right. So Paul is Dead is an urban legend and conspiracy theory a legend that Paul McCartney of the English rock band The Beatles died in November 1966 <laughs> and was secretly replaced by a lookalike. <laughs> <laughs> Trust me. Uh, the rumor began around 1967, but grew in popularity after being reported on American college campuses in late 1969. Uh, based on clues and songs and album covers. Yeah, that's another thing. Is all the no. nah, <laughs> listen, listen. Accord- like hear me, hear me, yeah, hear me. Nah. A- according to the theory, McCartney died in a car crash, and to. To the s- spare the public from grief, the surviving Beatles replaced him with a winner of a McCartney co- look McCartney lookalike contest, sometimes identified as William Campbell or Billy Shears. Afterward, the band were wrapped by guilt at their duplicity, so that's who it is, and man. therefore left a message on their music and album artwork to communicate the truth with their fans. These include the 1968 song "Glass Onion," in which Lennon sings, "Here's another clue for you: the walrus was the walrus was Paul." And the cover photo of their just released Abbey Road, in which McCartney is shown walking out of step with his bandmates. Hmm. Rumors yeah, declined. Interesting. The 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 McCartney lookalike thing was real as well. Yeah, yeah. The like. Yeah, they, yeah, they, they, at that time they held a it. they held a real yeah. fucking. But that's not like that's not, that's not necessarily like. No, I know, I know, but I know. It's just it's, it's a fucking. No, they probably would have done that anyway. I think go I, go look it up because it's got look it's got it here like it's got the whole story. Nah, I'm not gonna get into it. Some other people go look at that. People, there probably are people out there who genuinely believe yeah. that. But like, well, if people when, believe the Earth is flat, then yeah, 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 yeah exactly. They're that's the like concrete people, evidence. The same people, isn't it? What I just <laughs> said is yeah. like it's just like gospel <laughs> to them. Yeah, but I mean, wait, wait. When did you say it's all like 67, 67. That's like the height of Beatles fame. Yeah, like, so the reason so of course yeah. like probably there's bare conspiracies that came out about mm. them, like just people who were like such but great also, fans they want to believe also at the that same time in, in like devil's advocate or whatever in yeah, defense yeah. of the, the, the theory mm. like if one of the Beatles had died at that time obviously they would have been mass them. suicides yeah, and obviously shit. They would the first them. time ever there was like was proper yeah, like yeah, hysteria yeah. like yeah, teen yeah, hysteria yeah, and that's when the that's when the term teen got fucking made yeah yeah, like before that, there wasn't that group. Mm-hmm. It was like you, you came out of school and you went into work and shit, and then yeah. they made this like new group called teens, teenagers and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And like, there was never been that. So if one of them had died, it would have been mad. It would have been like, yeah, people, they, girls would have killed. Yeah. Girls were fainting, like they, yeah, so it was hundreds like, of them fainting and shit, like crazy shit. But. I don't know if that's true, but... Nah, it's, it's definitely... Nah, it's definitely, it's definitely not. Okay, still, so the, the, another died, funny but... thing. The girl... So basically, he's driving back from a show or some shit, yeah? Yeah. It's the story. Yeah, I'm fine. I'll tell you now, anyway. 
he's driving back from a show, sees some girl that's like pretty. He's like, all right, she's trying to hitchhike. So he pulls her over, picks her up. She gets in the car, realizes it's him, freaks out, like yeah. gets on him. They crash, he dies, she loses her leg. Yeah. Oh, that's the word that I was going to say. Yeah, How yeah. did he die? Did he reincarnate as her leg? Because <laughs> <laughs> that would be. Yeah. No, that's one I can get behind. Yeah. That's... So, MI5 turn up in that, yeah? Oh, man, this. <laughs> yeah. This is what everyone at work was saying as well yeah, today. Yeah. I was just like, yeah, because this, this one just cracks me up because I think it's funny as fuck. Definitely not true. Yeah, but it's but funny. It's just for comical. Who knows? Movie, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know what I mean? Can't disprove it. Who knows? Can't yeah, disprove it. Like. <laughs> you, you can't disprove it. Like, so. Do you watch Always Sunny in Philadelphia? Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah like, mate, it. fucking, that shit's like, fucking basic, dope. like, it's like when Mac is trying to explain why, like, science is wrong sometimes, and like, <laughs> um, like, what's he called? Like, Sir Isaac Newton, like, was a bitch, and he like brought out like a whole fucking, like, yeah, it's it's fucking true. So it's def- but that's the problem yeah, that's, that's, the, that's problem. the problem as well that's the problem with Trump can't disprove shit. it the problem like, with fucking Boris can't disprove oh, that he's fucking so I'll just put it to that level and nah, fuck Boris yeah. basically Ooh. this is the only time I will say to anyone like please just go just out it, and just fucking just vote just and like so once in a lifetime if I'm honest like it's a once in a lifetime period. vote for anyone but the Tory party Obviously. like, cause Lib- just, we, like we need to get them the, yeah just vote just for Labour, Labour just, vote just like for Corbyn Labour. is like given a completely like mad proposal okay. like their manifesto is crazy but if he can even get a third of it done or a it's mad, quarter better than or whatever then it's better than the even exactly manifesto. so just like yeah. come on for like the average the Is anyone like person like, out there working? Like the NHS or that? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Do you like, like the NHS? Do you like it? Tr- vote for Labour. Like, like, it's not even a joke. It's, it's actually not even a joke. No, it's not. It's really I not. would like, fucking Richard Branson will be the person have you who will be fucking, like controlling our NHS. Have you seen them like, American breakdowns of like money. if you go to hospital, yeah, you get like a broken arm and that. No, like no, the breakdown is like twelve hundred pounds for ambulance. Just for ambulance to come out and pick you up. It's like two fives here for a broken arm. Fuck man. Yeah, brothers. You're, you're, I mean, it's no joke. You know that the thing of like being one one paycheck away from rent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Imagine you got a you're one broken one finger one away from imagine, fucking yeah, infection. Imagine you got a two thousand five hundred bill for going hospital. Mate, imagine if you try and pick someone up and you get hernia and you're like, oh fuck, well. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. How mate, I've had like I've had like that's how people get two hernia, three yeah, operations. I've had like mad broken bones. I've had like mm. teeth done, bro, bro, like all this shit on the NHS. It's fucking amazing. It's the thing that makes our country actually. if I did it, kind of special. Yeah. Yeah. I don't understand why people. Like, I don't understand why anyone is voting against. Mate, them. unless unless my family let me be be crippled, billion, yeah, like people just they'd happen. be bankrupt. So much. Yeah. If we lived in the states, the only people trust me from like, when I broke with them bones yeah, and shit. Like, the scariest thing about it for me is like I want to pursue a career in film. Mm. And where in you know, film, yeah, obviously there's a massive film industry in the UK. But if you really want to break it, I'm not saying that it's ever going to happen for me. But it's a desire. Mate, li- the, the, build, the idea yeah. of living in America is quite scary, especially now. Yeah, yeah. Fucking, you got Trump, you've got the rise of this. Well, I don't, agenda. and I don't think that's the case anymore. Anyway, I'll be honest no, with you. No, no, no. Like, it's I not, think you could do it but here, it's, but and it's like something that I like when I was younger. But like up until maybe the ages of like sixteen, kind of figured that that was just what you had to do. Yeah, if you wanted to be in film. Yeah, yeah, you know, because you you grow up a bit and you're a bit like, okay, well, actually, there are ways to get this done without going to. Corporate, yeah. but there's, corporate. A, there's an attraction. Corporate corporations. To, there's an attraction to just going to the place where it's of course it's hub, like the hub of the. It's like you said, going to mm. New York, going yeah. on like a mm. pilgrimage, like an, yeah. a hip hop pilgrimage. Yeah, I hear so you. A, I've had five invites to DJ in New York. Like my fucking dream is to DJ in New York. That's yeah, that's I've fucking got there, invites. man. I've had five invites, bro. I've never done it. I go on, Timmy. Yeah. Next year, Juju from Beatnuts invited me. Up Next there. year, Timmy like, with you, boys. Mhm. It's crazy. Never went out there. Never been on. I've it. never, never. I went to Florida as a kid, really, really yeah. young for a. Like, I've never been on a plane. That's never. What it was man. That was too much. Yeah, I don't like flying. flying. And I'm all right with it now because, like, when my girlfriend would go on the plane a lot, but I used to fucking hate flying as a kid. Mm. You yeah. Just scare the shit out of me. Like, I start, like the first time I flew, I was 11. And we flew to Ireland. It was like an hour flight. Yeah. And it was like, yeah, cool. And then I, I was fine with flying up mm. until like. 
I can't remember, but just like one day, I just fucking didn't like it anymore. Yeah. I was like, I realized, I was like, yeah. no, hold on a second, like, <laughs> it's kind of real. I'm not in control <laughs> of shit. Like, yeah. I know it's like, yeah, yeah. I know it's like one in a fucking yeah. million chance yeah. of whack. It's like, like, like cool, like, yeah, that statistic is all good, do you but know why like, that someone's that one yeah, in a million. That statistic is there because there's more fucking cars than there is planes. Yeah, that's the only reason. Yeah, true. Oh, there's less plane crashes. Yeah, there's a million more cars. Yeah. Brilliant, more cars probably. Nah, because I reckon the statistic is based on. Nah, I don't work. You'd hope so. Carbon, it must be. Nah, that's the whole. Don't say that, bruv, because I like no, because it is because yeah, I. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> mate, the what this the thing that gets me. You need to uh, get me on a plane. I've never been on a fucking plane, bro. Never. You never been on a plane? No, I never flown that. No, never, nowhere. I went to Ireland on a boat. Uh, let's go fucking mate. Come to Spain. Come to Malaga. You get tickets yeah, for twelve friends. quid. I've got friends in fucking Barcelona. Yeah, come in France. Come live in there. In the I'm like, going to Montpellier in February. You will come. Yeah, yeah. You will come, Phil. Sure. February. Yeah, do a podcast out there. Uh, yeah, it's the podcast as well. February. Yeah, my girlfriend like, it might be living in Bristol at the time. She she'd be up for coming. She like, she speaks French, so she'd be down to come. That's cool. Yeah. But, yeah. Why not? Making bit. arrangements on camera. Yeah. Shouts to Two Tongues, man, because like oh, Two Tongues like put me on to fucking put us on to so many people in France, man. Mm. And like some of the people that he's put me on to have become like like good friends. You yeah, know what I mean? So I speak is. to them, like support each other. You know what I mean? Yeah. And they got a fucking strong hip hop scene up there, man. Yeah, no, yeah, I've man. listened to some of your stuff, but um, Ned, Ned. Nedua. Nedua. Well, the La Classique was like La a crew Classique, with like yeah, yeah. Nedua, uh, D Win, um, which vice versa. So it was, uh, the other, I don't, I don't want to disrespect and forget his name. But there's like, there's a lot of people there. Like it's like La Claps. Mm. Yeah, I've heard that the guy the beginning I, of I, the fucking. I just done a scratch man. intro for a Paris radio show. Mm. Yeah. Uh, G's on and someone else. But yeah, they got a big like boombox show out in Paris. Yeah, oh, I yeah, like just a lot of stuff that it comes out from. I don't listen to enough of it, which I think is quite sad. Yeah, it's sick. I don't really know who to listen to. It's not. They're just on it. It's like there's so yeah. much that you don't really know where to start. Like I'm yeah. kind of like a like, grime. Like a lot of my friends like grime, but I'm I like it and I'm happy to listen to it. But like they'll all this stuff will get released and the fuck play is and nowadays like, though, man. Yeah, that's well. That's I, I listen to be fair. I was gonna say like the most. I listen to like the old school heads. They're new shit, but I, like, all of it, man. I don't because I don't know it, so I, I don't really delve too much. Yeah. I get stuck in, I get stuck in musical yeah, loops, man. No more. There's no grand Pisses there. me off, man. Yeah. But send, send me if you listen to all of it. Send me some of the shit you listen to, because yeah, I'm like stuck in these little things, loops. Same like for me, man. Just like, put it in the group chat or something. Yeah. Find something you like. Just. Well, there's like do you shit, find that I'm always, you, get, you get stuck in like, you, you go to work yeah, and you fucking yeah. have like the same thing I'm not as bad when I'm at work, as I used like, to be yeah. when I'm at work I need to listen to things that I already know the words to yeah. so I don't like zone off yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I chop your on, finger off or yeah, yeah, I have to like, focus on work so I don't need to zone into uh, music so more time I just I listen to podcasts at work to be fair yeah podcasts mm, or something you to learn about like I should start fucking learning French or some shit yeah, really. I need to. Yeah, you know I mean, I need Duolingo to just, at work. Yeah, just fucking. Oh, learn. my Duolingo. I, do, I Duolingo don't know. I didn't find it very useful. It does, but it doesn't. Work. But if you need to go ask for a glass of water. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Stuff like that. <laughs> anecdotal, like <laughs> little bits and like bits and pieces. But I'm really bad. Like I'm really fucking. Busu, that's a big deal. Yeah, I don't know. Languages for me is I need like strict, rigid structure. Otherwise, I'm gonna let myself yeah. slack off, and it's just I don't know. I can ask how to fucking ask her the, like, where the bathroom is in Spanish or where the library is or where la biblioteca why is it that that's like the one that I, do you reckon it's because biblioteca is like such Stand a memorable fucking word, word. Maybe, biblioteca yeah because yeah. everyone knows but that Helen get... says that as well <laughs> <laughs> the worst thing about like my level of Spanish is I can ask where something is but can't understand the directions are given to me <laughs> yeah. yeah so it's like as long if it's in a hundred meter radius, I'm sound because they can point to it. But otherwise, you say it's it mad like, slow and they say a hundred miles an hour. Yeah, even if you oh, do, it's funny how the English people do that though. Yeah, because they're like, it's like it's not gonna make yeah. any fucking difference. Like you say it <laughs> yeah, real slow. It's like no, but that's when they come and speak your language, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. like if a Spanish person comes here, 
and speaks English to you, you think, yeah, <laughs> that if you slow down English, you're talking their language. <laughs> no, because you come through the door. <laughs> Mate, I, I tell you what, yeah, and this is no disrespect at all, yeah, but I, up front used to kill it, yeah. <laughs> like he's, Obviously, like, it was just the first few times, obviously, like, we hadn't been away, you know what I mean? We were like, going to these new places and shit. Yeah. It was all like a fucking new experience, you know what I mean? And like, when we get pissed, like as, it only happened a couple of times, but like, it would just be like, no, but like, when you do <laughs> this, and then, and it was just like, these people were like, yes, I know what you're saying. I understand you, but it, it's just like, oh. It reminds you of some like I feel like it's something that should be in like Anchorman or like Tokyo like, 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 Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's yeah, it's uh, it's fucking joke. Like, my my mum used to like um have foreign students, like exchange students that would come and stay with us when we used to live in uh Exmouth. Like, fucking it's an all right place, but a bit boring. But what I used to find without doing it, I would end up talking in English but talking in their accent without realizing, like, not yeah, so all the I mean, time, yeah. but just be like, say I had a French person, <laughs> I'd end up saying, like, ah, hold it. <laughs> no, not like, you know, just That's horrible, I mean. like being really, just That's not even, saying. not like intentional, not being yeah, like trying to take the piss of them. It's just, just like, I'd realize I'd say hello polite, really like, weirdly, uh, and I'd be like, it's an English thing of trying to be polite but being real disrespectful. Yeah. 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 I did to my boss, man. He's Welsh, isn't it? Like, yeah. he's just oh, like, oh, oh, me. Oh. Hi, bye. Forget the word. <laughs> 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 he knows it's all a fucking joke, yeah. but. I can't. I can't even yeah. help myself doing it. Like Welsh is the worst one for me, man. Yeah, like, Welsh, is Welsh like I just because like to be fair, yeah, I don't think I've met. An unfunny Welsh person. Like Welsh people no. are always funny. We're, like, like for our first, they're fucking always funny. They're always comedy funny. is on point. They're always like, funny, and proper like low key council estate comedy. Yeah, it's just it always is on yeah. point. Just easy, like smooth. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Without, without, without trying. Yeah. Yeah. Like in the first project we did for uni, we got put into groups. And it was me, Tommy, and this Welsh kid, and it was like you had to introduce yourselves in some way. So what we did is we like made like um. Yeah, you know, you'd ever play like Street Fighter and like Tekken and shit mm. when you'd like you'd choose your character and they'd be like rotating and there'd be like a weird kind of like graphic in the background and yeah. they would have like their stats and shit. We had like for the Welsh guy, we were like, Well, what do you wanna put for yours? And he was like, Well, like for my strength it can be like uh, like can summon like no, no, wait. Your pink, bro. No, fucking what was it? Oh no, his strength was just the Welsh accent, his weakness was sheep and his special ability was, yeah, I knew it was in Oh, um can See, summon bro. his special ability was can it summon was. Rob Ryden. Yeah, it to be. Which I thought was genius. <laughs> can summon Rob Ryden, like imagine you're playing Tekken and suddenly you press a button and Rob Ryden appears like <laughs> Just talks you out the whole situation. Like, yeah, exactly. Just diffuses the situation. That'd be banging. Mind the box. But, yeah, they. All, I don't know. Just, I think they're probably just used to English people taking the piss out of them. Probably uh, they're just like, oh, you're gonna mention sheep, yeah. or you're gonna mention like a stereotype that we're all. Uh, so there's 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 a there's a village or a, a town in Wales where it was like the final frontier of like I think Cromwell's army, right? Yeah. And what they did is loads of the men mm. would like go super clean shaven, like the fucking feminine looking men or whatever, dress up as women, like seduce the fucking Cromwell soldiers and shit and no. kill them all. And they oh, couldn't God. get past this one town. <laughs> and I, I don't know what the town is, shouts yeah. to the town if someone fucking yeah, knows yeah, it. Somewhere yeah. out there, like put it in the Drop it in, yeah. Because, yeah. <laughs> Cause, yeah. <laughs> that's the that's problem with my brain right is I'll fucking you think of it I remember things yeah. yeah and I'll be able to like s almost articulate it in a way that's understandable yeah, yeah, yeah. but I'll forget where the sources are and I'll be like yeah I've seen this thing this one time when do you know what I mean it's yeah. like pub talk isn't it it's and it's like, like oh, I, had this fuck, one, like, I need to like learn how to like me. log shit in my brain so like I, like, I, I hear something I'm like <laughs> it's like reference a mental point. bibliography or yeah yeah. It'd be, It'd be good that's to like do. some mind palace type shit. That's like I don't know what like, the fuck mind palace. You know, palace is. where it's like the idea that you can like tap into more of your brain and be like fucking. Yeah. Like, you can like. That's true. Fight like almost like not like this is obviously like Hollywoodized this idea, but like you can tap into like, like you said, like oh you want to find a source for something, you could like oh I read this here or like, 
it's stuff or like, like, it's like, stuff like a computer like level rather than stuff, a fucking what, yeah kind of it's stuff of like sci-fi mixed with ideas of like mindfulness and just like keeping your brain mm. fucking active and shit and being aware of your surroundings and aware of how you feel and blah 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 and aware of how to train your memory and shit mm. like, there are people out there who can remember like sequential numbers of codes that are like thousand like, people who memorize pi mm. to like the but it's mad that like five thousandth number or something or yeah I, I, and a lot of, a lot of those people are on the spectrum as well yeah which is yeah, crazy it's like like yeah it's, it's just a different like, cognitive like yeah way of thinking it's mad man like to have like a a, a picture memory or right. like to be a yeah Who obviously knows? it's it's just we don't understand no, no, no. that yet you know what i mean it's, it's like, like also the idea of like someone with a photographic memory i think is probably not what we all like perceive it to be like it's not like they can just exactly maybe like visualize it mm. i don't know i've not met anyone who, ha who has one but i think probably like slightly different than like how movies portray like where someone's like oh i read this in 1982 i don't know like have you seen have you seen the the video like it went viral of the guy who flew over new york in a helicopter for like just one flight over yeah, new yeah, york yeah. and he draws the whole of new york okay, Maybe it is like the whole now nah, like I think with, with, with like if it's like a prop like picture might memory might be different like but it's shades exactly like well it's the same like as the whole shades. spectrum so yeah, like yeah, with yeah. with autism mm -hmm. or like any or of those or things or like, on a, like there's a on massive placement. spectrum mm -hmm. and like you could be here or you could be here and it's still yeah that probably is the same, same thing but there's so, much so it might be the same with might be the same we, there's so much we don't know that it's like impossible to say like yeah this is how it does it like mm. how the brain works or how the brain memorize, remembers something because I think one of the things that they said on the video that I watched is like if you've got um, like loads of numbers that are like sequentially ordered you take the number and you give it a corresponding letter so like a 5 would be an S a 3 would be an E for example mm. and then you just remember groups of 4 and you just remember like a, a, like a word that looks like those letters if that makes sense so like it look, makes sense like, it's just like, like it just, well, I don't understand it myself but it's like it, it, something that's going to give you a visual something yeah, yeah, to like a, yeah like a memory so you, of so that just, sequence which yeah. you know the fucking and then you can number. do it easily but yeah. I say easily yeah. but it's about, I suppose it's about mem like, uh, it's like memorising segments yeah like compressing yeah. like a number yeah. into a segment yeah. and then memorising the segment to remember the indiv individual parts yeah fucking Man, yeah, I, I was. I was for dinner last night. And I'm yeah, like, I was <laughs> bad with maths, man. Like, yeah, I don't know. I got. A, I think I got a D in maths. And GC the thing is, I did GCSEs don't mean shit. Like, I don't mean to fucking be oh, that no, guy no, that no, says no, it, no. but honestly, yeah, really. like, yeah. so long as you're dedicated to something, you will <coughs> like find succeed your own, at it. Find yeah. your own way. Cheesy, GCSEs actually in don't life. mean shit unless you want to go uni then get your GCSEs in fact get your GCSEs anyway because you might as well, well if it's you not hard nice. you fucking fair, I don't even know they even call GCSEs GCSE English like, if you can if yeah, you can get them yeah yeah I like them you should I don't know yeah you should just get them you should get them but if you can't get them you should not worry about it too much high school secondary school Sorry. Is it yeah, high yeah, yeah, school? Yeah, yeah, Can you say high school? You can't say high school in England. No, it's secondary um, school. Secondary school. Senior school, right. isn't it? Senior, it's secondary, bro. It used to be called yeah, senior school. Is it? No, yeah, it's secondary senior school. school, man. Senior is school? Yeah, secondary is senior, senior school. Same thing, but. Right. Senior. Yeah, senior is junior, high school. junior and senior. Junior high. <laughs> now, we used to have junior Pretty school. <laughs> junior school, <laughs> and it, it was infants, junior, and then senior. That's weird. Demonic. Play school, primary, or kindergarten, primary. Oh. Yeah. That's American. But then they have middle school, don't they? Yeah, but I went to a fucking a Steiner kindergarten, innit? Steiner. Yeah. Steiner. Rosicrucian yeah. shit. What was Steiner it? Rosicrucian. That's Rosicrucian? What, yeah, that's where their beliefs come from. Rosic oh, fuck no. Rosicrucian science. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> all, I, all I know is <laughs> people got away with shit. Someone should say. True should, story, yeah? Let's, let's do more conspiracies. All right, let's, let's go into more conspiracies then. Let's get a laptop. Yeah. Let's get no, some. Now you say someone. Yeah. I mean, laptop. I don't know, man. Like, I don't know. Yeah, enough, on, like, in, in deep, that I could be like, oh, yeah, this one well, nah, believes it's it because of this. Like, like there's what's, a million to choose. I'll have a look, man. What's. I might rejog my memory. 
The thing is, I, st- I kind of stopped following all that shit because it got a bit like... Took it a bit off, No, I know, that's the other point though. That's the, the funny bit week. because... Right, list of conspiracy theories. When you know, when you step back from it and you actually know what's going on, you well, can okay. just pick oh, up quiet. Right. Yeah, Let's and, go just what, and just have like yeah, a little yeah. vote. Right, actually, we have so that's many different categories. We've got like mm. business, deaths and disappearances, espionage, ethnicity, race and religion, UFOs. Wow. Sport for choice, yeah. Espionage. I read um, there was like some fucking I think it was like a KLM flight. I can't remember where the fuck I was coming back from, and um, it had like a I can't remember if it was like Business Insider or Business or it mm. was like a, a like st- magazine. Yeah, yeah, stock market magazine basically, like, but like like, like a business. Shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe the what, Economist. Is, yeah, yeah, that's what or some shit. Mm. It was some American fucking hardback or whatever. And it had like this whole article of like maybe five or six different um, activities that the CIA did mm. yeah. that were like setting up a coup mm. or fucking bringing down a country or like taking down a, like a, a key leader or yeah. some shit like that. Like some of them that went well, some of them went wrong. Like, and this is all like declassified shit now. Mm. And it's literally, you read that, you watch everything that's going on right now, like say with Gaddafi, yeah. Chile, like, and don't get me wrong, I'm not trying to get on no political yeah, shit. We don't know our shit. Here. I don't know. This I don't is, know nothing. This is but just speculation. Yeah, it's interesting, man. I mean, I'm trying to think. I, one did pop into my head, but it's fucking gone. Um, oh yeah, shit. What, what do you think about the, um, like the the idea that Nazi um, like generals and high ranking officers and scientists. Mm-hmm. Like Himmler. escaped, Himmler. escaped. The, bruv, there's a whole, there's a whole there's town nothing. in South America. So yeah, yeah. But a this whole is town. Quite like fucking. I mean, the head of NASA was a fucking scientist yeah. for the Nazis. Yeah. You run that shit. But don't quote me. I'm thinking a long time, like yeah. good twenty years. Bruv, so the fucking Himmler, Americans that was snapped them shit, off, they snapped they all of them up, and like just places took like them. Peru, a lot of South America. Mate, there's that whole town. There's a whole town yeah, yeah, yeah. where there's a story now about the it kid that got like out. A Vice documentary or something. It might not be Vice. It might, you know. I can't remember, remember the fuck I heard that. But I feel like I've seen something like that as well. Just like a lot, like descendants of basically high-ranking officers who have escaped during like. So the Nuremberg trials. Nah, they all, they all, like they all dipped. They all dipped over there. Like they were like, yeah, we'll give you immunity, but you've got to like, make all this shit for us. And once you made it, like you can yeah. go and live in fucking Peru hmm. and make a little Nazi village. You scum. But they hmm. weren't like that. They probably, they're probably down with them. Fuck knows. Like the thing is with conspiracies, man. Is like, especially on shit like this, is like, what about a music conspiracy? What do you mean? Some I I just I f- all the all them music conspiracy isn't it? Mu- well, music is a conspiracy. No, there's a big music conspiracy yeah, theory. Yeah, you could say the way that the fucking it, like, labels versus but, artists. You know, nah, right? no, nah, I mean, but the hip hop in the fucking. No, nah, the the Rihanna videos and the the you know the symbol symbolism. All oh, right, yeah, yeah. Of stuff there's that. Yeah, Obviously, people that's read the main thing. But that's yeah, the main conspiracy is that like it. because they're just riding a wave though? Because like, yeah. everyone started doing the fucking little Eye of Horus and like yeah, all the mad. fucking the Jay Z Do you know the only really thing that makes me think about it? There's one Rihanna video, right? And for absolutely no reason, they chop, like, they chop the way the scene is of mm. her picture and make her back arch up more than it could possibly do if she was, like, doing it. Mm. And like no matter what the conspiracy is, that's that's actually in the video. Yeah, it's like, like a, why the fuck do they do it? Obviously, the conspiracy ties bro, in. Bro, you like, get that in so many levels, especially. This is on some I mean, we can't shit. talk to an extent because none of us are like uh, female artists. No, so we don't course. know what the like the yeah, idea, the, the, the level. But that just be like some kind of visual like, effect shit, right? Yeah, but it's like it's a it's a body. What, what yeah, but like, like, yeah, yeah, but yeah, but yeah, but like, say with this and that media, like, if you wanted to fucking contort my fucking that makes sense arm or my fucking because he made my head real big. Yeah, yeah, it's I essentially know, the same like, thing, but more, more, sense, yeah. more fucking. Um, I don't know, like artistically, not artistically creative because it's yeah. a fucking different thing. But like, it's that it's is, more detailed, yeah, isn't it? Making it looks, someone's body stretch and shit, yeah, and making I, it look I guess good. If, if, I if it looks disturbing, I haven't seen. If it looks video. disturbing, they must have done a fucking good job. 
Yeah. So it, it must yeah. be, unless it's like well, so out of place well, there's, that there's it's a spectrum weird. For that. Yeah. Yeah. Doing a really surely, good job. surely there must be it's other weird. It's the one that weird. caught my attention out of all of the conspiracy theories. Isn't yeah. It? That's, the, that's the one. But there's loads of them. There's loads of fucking. Have you seen the Michael Jackson? All right. The, all right Michael Jackson fucking uh, smooth criminal video. No. Do you know about that one? No, I don't know. Well, I mean, that, 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 I mean that whole no. song takes on a whole new meaning. That, after that's the, whole the right. So that's the one. Yeah. So right, that's the one where he escaped the label and all that stuff. Yeah. Mm. So he was just like, I, Michael. He knew he could market himself and escape the labels, all that type of stuff. <laughs> but apparently, that whole video is just like symbolism to like escaping the labels. Le. and just coming on his own and just being all that type of and then after that mm. they just come down on him hard with the pedo thing innit yeah it's fucked man yeah man, I don't know that even that whole documentary is a bit of a the not a conspiracy it got it's it got, got, got cancelled it's been cancelled it's been cancelled it's been cancelled thank you uh, that I was going to say because it's been cancelled because it was false they, it was loads fraudy. of the shit they came out with was false was loads fraudy. of the stuff they said was fake yeah they got fucking no, basically lit they, up. The, the director director was lit fucking up. a sketchy no, no, dude. At one point, they got lit up on you. Yeah. They, they said that all of this stuff yeah, that happened... In a place that wasn't was, built yet. wasn't built. It wasn't even built when they said it happened. Oh, so, okay. yeah, they fucked right the, the, up. That's then, such yeah. shitty evidence. The guy, so. do, the guy who was doing a video, yeah, yeah, he tried to come in and go, oh, let me just change the dates. That nah, you can't change the dates, is it? Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing? Yeah. Jesus. What about, hold on, let's bring it local though, yeah? Because this is something that, like, this is something that should essentially even fucking affect your vote, yeah? Because the Tory party have been on some fucking protective paedophile bullshit from day, yeah? Jimmy Savile, yeah, Yeah, used to go to Margaret Thatcher's house on Christmas. Yeah, they're all fucking paedos. Do you know what I'm saying? They are all in that fucking shit, yeah? Trust me. And, like... If they ain't in it, they know about it and they're fucking keeping quiet. Yeah, and, just, and, just and, and this Prince Albert shit. Andrew. Andrew. Prince Andrew. Yeah. They're all the... F- <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fuck. That's fucked I, up. Did you see the, the interview that he gave well, he to has the like, go, of Channel he, 4 or whatever? He, he has to go to American police, isn't it? Like, that's yeah, but yeah, that's, that's what they're saying. They're do, saying like, you should come forward, bro, because... Yeah, because obviously... We know. They want to chat to him and he's not going Because he's pulled away from public... We know what you're on. We know what they're all on. Which is like the it might official be like, way of it might be like some fucking like French Revolution public. shit. Like, I pulled away from. Public well, do you watch the the debate with Boris and? and no, I don't watch it. No, mate, I've never been so gassed at politics in my life. Like watching, actually watching man, imagine, he's a blubbering yeah. idiot who can't like actually answer a question. Did, did Corbyn like, hold himself down? Yeah, I'll break it down for you. He has to. Yeah. But Boris couldn't answer a question without like. I he was trying point. to quote one thing in it. Yeah, he just kept going yeah. back to Brexit. One person yeah. asked him, why can we trust both of you? Fair question to ask. Yeah. Boris was like, well, I, I can't answer that question because how can I say how you're going to trust me? I can't judge myself with a, like, oh a fair part. And then he goes I'm on a run and then he brings idiot. it back to Brexit. It's like, you can't trust this man because he doesn't even like say which yeah. side he wants yeah, to Yeah, All like, he's saying is that's what he's going to do, though, isn't it? <laughs> Well, Corbyn, Corbyn's just saying what he's going to do. Like, well, he's saying what he wants to do. The, he wants the thing to do, is, yeah. is, is, the he's manifesto gonna, is, yeah, is everyone fucking. Everyone knows he's not going to be able to do everything. Not, yeah, he's but that's the thing. Yeah, but he's he's aiming for it. That's exactly. what I'm saying. Manifest Never in the fucking brilliant. history of our fucking life, yeah, ever in the history of our fucking parents' lives, yeah, yeah. People, mm-hmm. yeah. in the history of our parents' parents' lives, know, yeah, not, in England, has that happened like this? I honestly I don't. I, I believe that, like, with my heart. Man. Those people I genuinely yeah. believe that. To all the people that I don't, don't vote as well. The, like, I, I saw an analogy for the people that don't vote, yeah. Mm. And it's like, if you're getting the bus somewhere, yeah, and your bus doesn't come, you're not gonna like not get the bus that goes closest to the destination. Do you know what I mean? Mm. You're not gonna ignore that bus. You're still gonna get the bus that goes closest to that one. That's the same thing. Mm. Mm. Like, it's not about fucking. Oh, it's not perfect, so I'm just not gonna vote. Yeah, yeah. Like, you vote to like, 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 like,
The like, best honestly, thing now I reckon it's fucked. The best thing now as well is the Tory party are actually fucking shitting it. Yeah, that's the better. good thing to watch right now. The, like, the best part. Yeah, but that's the play. algorithm we're locked in. Is yeah, that the case on the fucking Tory side? Do you reckon they see that, or do you reckon yeah, they, they see that, like yeah, they see that. Tories are fucking killing it? Ah, they see that. It's a good question see. though. Well, they'll they'll have people that will be paid to look at the other side, won't they? They'll be yeah, paid. They see that man. They look know. at what they're trying to do. They set up that thing in it on Twitter. Mate, the fuck, the <laughs> fucking fucking scumbags, man. What happened? Michael Gove. They it set up a thing on Twitter, yeah. This page on Twitter saying it was an independent fact checker. Yeah, but it was, but it was the actually CCHQ. just them, so they were going to no. just give you the yeah, wrong facts. Like, it was just up, a conservative Twitter. They got page. Twitter in it because Twitter called them out on it yeah. and just said, no, you can't was, do that. Like, they interviewed Michael Gove about it, and he was just like, the interviewer asked if he could. That's um, swear so fuck that everyone's actually trying this shit like it's it normal again. now like, everyone's just trying it like it's normal politics, yeah. bruv it's, it's turned into like this politics fucking mad game bruv it's turned it, honestly do you know who started it Black Mirror bruv nah <laughs> nah Putin's <laughs> advisor he was a fucking a, a, a director of theatre yeah yeah and he it's fucking basically figured out a new way of politics by just causing chaos yeah. you back everyone you don't it's know who, who's ages, what what's a celebrity what's it's just advanced it's just advanced, man. It's been going for ages. The same way. Yeah, not to be fair, shit. you're right. It's just super advanced. Oh shit, they've all gone off. Oh shit. But it said there was room on the country in this right thing. Um, Apart from that one. That one's still going. <laughs> yeah, going yeah, that's cool though. Um. Oh no, wait. It says SD card end on that one as well. Right. well I don't know when we fucking lost it, but. Wait, uh, audio is still, but the audio is still going. Yeah, the audio's. That's cool. We'll run the audio. Should we stuff. just wrap it up and then? Yeah. 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 Mm. Wrap it up like a samosa. Yeah. So we don't know exactly when we lost the cameras, but. Yeah. Like this has been a goodbye to the people that are watching. Yeah. It was nice seeing you. It's <laughs> alright. I'll be able to put pictures in my face. Just, just, the just pictures like too. real close up of yeah, your face. Just, yeah, some blurry n like nostril shots. Uh, yeah, well, yeah. I mean, it, it, to be fair, bro, um, it's been interesting. Yeah, I, it's been, it was not what I was expecting coming here, and I think it's actually been quite nice. I forgot the cameras were here for most of the time. It's quite nice to just actually in, not interview you guys. I didn't really ask you a whole. I didn't really dig that deep, but just sit down and chill. Yeah, that's right. Chats, you worked it out. Yeah, exactly. Better worked it. Better than doing nothing. Yeah, isn't it white, man? Fuck you, yeah, and now. Who, what's next then? Oh, what's next? Oh, shit. Um, For the people listening, you want to go check out www.fattyloo.co.uk. Yeah, <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to think of whether it's calm or not, fat now. Nah. Mm, just type in fat, fat it'll, it'll come up. Yeah, it'll yeah, come up. Yeah, yeah, that's the worst promotion ever. Yeah. <laughs> I'll tell you what, I want to get one of those new fucking section red jumpers, the hoodies. Like velvety, like mm. soft, man. They look very nice. Very, very nice. Shouts to Ollie for that. Yeah, yeah super Ollie cool. likes his velour, doesn't he? Velour is the old school, isn't it? 88 times. Velour tracksuit. Yeah, man. And shell toes. Slip Rick. Do you ever rock that? No. Nah. No, nah, I, I could no, never I did, rock I that. I did actually, but you, not. Is it? Not, well, not, like once. Not in the. Yeah, like once. You gave it up. <laughs> now, my friend had a collection, and I think we went to a party once and he let me rock his Velour troop tracksuit. Yeah. Yeah. Do you know, I did one thing yeah, that I'll, I will fucking admit now and never again. Yeah, mm. is you? Do you remember those trousers, like the real baggy ones with the two lines down the side? Uh, but no, not, no, not they're disgusting. Not really. Yeah, like proper bad. They're like not even blue first, box or nothing, bro. They're just they're, no, they weren't. The, they weren't like the, the blue box. Ones. They were like no, the, yeah, the pro, yeah, 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 yeah. 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 And like yeah, denim with the t shirt. Yeah, and uh. Like yeah, like white, I just white, started like, skating, white, and I was like, I'd never fun. been into something like I was just into football yet. But yeah. skating was different. It was like, and I thought like, oh, you have to like get the offspring. I like, you know what I mean? I was like, into offspring because you know offspring's mean? wicked. I yeah, still love offspring. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, yeah, so I, I fucking I spent like I'd like saved up 
saved up pocket money cleaning car and shit and whatever and uh yeah i spent like fucking 20 quid or some shit on these knockoff ones of those like they're jeans yeah and i literally bad man i yeah i wore them <laughs> for 20 minutes yeah, cussed out mate my fucking <laughs> grandma and granddad laughed at me yeah oh, and from when they laughed at me oh, i took them off i yeah. never put them on again oh. but it was in house Nah, I got them in the shop. Like even my mum, like I could yeah, see it when I seen her when she looked at me. I was just like, I was like, I know this is wrong. You know when you're like a kid and you're like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know I look stupid, but is that the right thing? Because sometimes you, you know what I mean. Yeah. yeah. And then it's from when my fucking yeah, from when my nan and granddad just were just like, Nah, if you worked out in house, that's good. I was like, Nah, I'm done. And that was that. Yeah. You know Those I mean? are the worst ones. They were bad, man. They yeah, were some. That was some like. There, that was some college green, fucking two thousand and one, two thousand and two. Yeah, chain wallet, man. Yeah, man. The fucking whole chain and jitters, <laughs> jitters. <laughs> That's what it used to be <laughs> like. Jitters, yeah, really like, people used to spit on me and shit. Oh, and jitters, fucking, man. Yeah, yeah man. We used to jitters. get fucking harassed, bro. Jitters you were a skater. Good. Uh, yeah, yeah. used to get harassed in my school, man. They were well, really popular in my school. Is, well, is, that, is that what people would call like skaters and shit? Mm. People, yeah, like, even skaters. Mm. Nah, just more people just into like metal and rock. And yeah, but the yeah, but the, yeah, but the yeah, thing yeah. is, it's like everyone was into skate. All those rocker kids yeah, and shit yeah. were into skated at the mm-hmm. time. Mm-hmm. So you'd be yeah, even if you weren't that, that even if you weren't that kid, you'd still be branched in as like a jitter, and you get fucking. Yeah, that was alright. That was later for me because. When it was earlier, it's it was character just hip-hop kids. It. it was hip hop kids and them kids, yeah. And I'll tell you what brought it together literally in school was Cypress Hill and Onyx. They mixed together like hip hop kids and kids that was into like grunge and Nirvana and stuff like that. And they kind of mixed together through, through those groups. There was another group called No Effects, who used to like have. Yeah, rap. No Effects, I yeah. remember No Effects. Rap and like yeah. guitars as well, do you know what I mean? And obviously Rage and it. Yeah, so I was going to say, it's like a different, it's like, like a tamer, like more punky rage. Yeah. Before rage, effects, like, I think before rage, like right. Cypress Hill bridged that gap. Onyx, like there was a few kids. Well, no, it was like Run DMC and fucking Aerosmith. No, yeah, originally. Yeah, yeah, if you get like that. <laughs> yeah, originally. But like now, because that dipped off, man. I'm talking like early 90s. Yeah. Like, that was like 80s, 70s. Yeah, 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 yeah. So like early 90s, I think it was Cypress Hill. Also, House of Pain, um, Onyx, those type of. Groups. Have you heard Everlast new shit? Everlast, I love Everlast. Have man. you heard his new shit though? Like, nah, not really new stuff. I haven't. Do you know who Everlast no, is? I, Everlast. I love Everlast, man. He's a fucking. See, I only knew who Everlast was you know, yeah, for years album, over a fucking Eminem bar. Right. Where, it, where it's yeah, like yeah, yeah, yeah. Everlast when he's yeah, fucking yeah, yeah. me for him and then ass yeah, or some he, shit. He was like, pissed off with him for some reason. Yeah, yeah, I don't know what it was, but like yeah, some bullshit. But Everlast like, is a bad boy. Yeah, I heard him on a couple of podcasts, like checked out a couple of tunes and shit, and it's yeah, it's alright, man. It's like Everlast first it's album, like, man. He's on the front cover with boxing gloves, isn't he? He's got yeah, a, he's got he tells part. that story on the podcast. Super, as well. super skinny kid. Yeah, and then he just got mad, like he looks like Troy now, isn't it? <laughs> 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 that Viking build. How come? Um, how come your girl lives in Spain then? She, uh, so she's we, Spanish, or? yeah, yeah, she's Spanish. So we, um, my mum moved to Spain last September. Um, they 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 had moved beforehand. Like my mum, like n- not my stepdad, cause not married, but basically my stepdad, um, my two younger sisters and my younger brother. Um, they moved out. Like they tried to move out when I was ten, but it kind of only lasted like six nine months. They just kind of got like homesick and it didn't work out and shit. Um, and then they came back to England for a while and then um, and then they always kind of wanted like my mum's always wanted to move like somewhere that isn't England they've just been fed up of, of living here basically yeah. so they moved out there um, and I went out to visit them and we just like I met her my girlfriend in like the town over just because like well my parents said there's fucking nothing to do it's do you speak Spanish yet? not very no not, is she Spanish though? She's Spanish and she's studying translation, uh, like to be an interpreter. Ah, okay, I see. So she's mate, she puts me to shame. <laughs> but I can, but I did a bit of French. I got a B in French. I can't speak very good French at all. My Spanish is even worse. She can speak English fluently, Spanish fluently, of course. 
French fluently. She speaks a little bit of Dutch. She's studying to speak Russian. And I'm just there like, oh, hello. Oh, yeah, really nice to meet you. <laughs> but, um, Say a lot of hand movements, <laughs> like. But, oh, man. But, no, no, I love, I love this piece. Of, I didn't think, although doing long distance would work, I never thought that that would be something that would, like, actually, especially at this age as well, like, 19, that's a bit, yeah. like, weird. It's not something that's normal. How do you find giving up your Fridays as well? <laughs> Mate, to be fair, to, the to be fair, like, I've actually, like, I've enjoyed Sorry. it a lot. I, this is probably the best one because I actually get to, I, I'm the guest, I get to sit on the sofa and talk and I get to, just, yeah. I, you know, pick your brains. But honestly, I've, I've enjoyed it and it's, like, I thought, I would like to have approached you guys and people like of your stature in the scene maybe three years like after like once I finish uni and I don't like I don't want to get um, complacent or take things for granted but I think that I'm on the right track if I'm you know doing this for you guys now yeah. mm. at 19 rather than waiting till I'm like 30 and being like oh I want to do yeah. some shit in my life, yeah you know? no you want to I, I think you're right mate to be fair like get it in and and don't fun, waste the time and live like, in Bristol if I want to go out yeah there's other nights I can go out like, yeah shit. save it set yourself up then yeah. you can go out <laughs> with money well, yeah. yeah exactly I mean, <laughs> job sometimes I'm just setting a night setting one night to a project that you're doing it's nice uh, to have a it's like super healthy and it yeah no nah, you, f- the you should man the like, thing is, yeah. is super healthy and I think when you when you do things like that other things around you build as well isn't it? Yeah. yeah like you get locked into that Definitely. yeah I think this is this is a good part of my structure yeah. right now well, you had a bit you had a James girl. Brown buff to me isn't it? you had <laughs> you had a James Brown a bit of <laughs> the cheese grater if anyone asks me who works hard in Bristol I'm like sorry James Brown isn't it? <laughs> how much you can his man <laughs> I just reckon this is the fucking one bro because like even this the guest who was supposed to be here didn't show up yeah cheers we sat down. We just like, we've <laughs> talked for fucking just over two two, hours now. two plus hours. Yeah, I was thinking when we sat down, I was like, "This is probably gonna be a sh- like the shortest one." But yeah. it's not. There's a wish shit to talk about, exactly, man. man. And like the thing is, f- just for me and how I feel when I go to work and shit. Mm. Like if I'm not talking with the people around me, if I'm in a conversation, in like in my headphones, mm. that's way better a lot of the time they listen to music like you can listen to music like I listen to music as well you know what I mean you yeah, break yeah, up yeah. the day but yeah sometimes I feel like like what you said earlier like do you listen to music and like you get loops of what you listen to yeah that I do get me. that but like I'm so much better than I used to be when I first fucking started listening to hip hop and like high focus and shit and like listen to people like Leap Dog and, and and Four Hours and like Jam Baxter and, and like, all of these people it would just it would be that it would be that going to school it would be that fucking during yeah. school if you got yeah. a chance to put your earphone in it would be that what do you listen to school. nowadays like on a daily mix of stuff man like it's mostly normally hip hop yeah. like I mean I'm trying to think what's at the top of my Spotify right? actually I'll get it up but I mean I listen to a lot of old 90s stuff I mean yeah. that's always going to be like my favourite like I you? love that boom bap sound Be on your daily like when you're at work and stuff like what do you listen to like if I'm being honest because I get stuck in these loops it's literally either fucking my Cuban playlists and shit yeah. or like hip hop tracks yeah. or like albums or some shit do you know what I mean I'll pick an album that's like to be fair at work yeah it's different because at work I'll pick something that everyone's gonna like yeah, as a player for a speaker yeah. so it'll be something that's like yeah. middle of the road easy to listen to. I yeah. used to put on like non-fiction and shit and just be like... Please everyone, <laughs> it's, it's, Yeah, it's just like... The CIA murdered your soul! It's just like, everyone's like, whoa, chill, man. Yeah. Now it's a bit different. I've got to like, cater to the fucking masses. And my boss does not like... Don't like he don't even like hip-hop, really. He just doesn't get it. He just, yeah. he can't even... He can't even... It's mad, there's like this weird age gap. And I think like... Yeah, it's like the after this age gap it's the same with my mum and dad like yeah. they just they're just slightly past this fucking little gap where yeah. they just they they can't understand it 
They just they, they can't yeah. understand like even half the like the slang and shit is way gone past them. Do you know what yeah. I mean? We pick up yeah, with stuff yeah, so yeah, much yeah. quicker because the internet. Yeah, do you know yeah. what I'm saying? And if new slang comes out, even if it's from kids, it, it fucking goes yeah, straight up the ladder yeah. real quick, yeah. and we all know about it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Everything is instant. Loop, Back like, then, yeah, like something new comes yeah. out, and if you don't, if you're not connected with the fucking youth or whatever, like yeah. that's that. You don't know shit. Yeah. You're fucking completely out of the loop, like. Yeah. So it must have been like, yeah, and then they just true. can't get it. Like my boss, he just, he's, uh, even I'll play him slow shit. I'm like, do you, do you understand this like, though? Listen to the words or something. And he's like, <laughs> he'll like pick out like maybe one or two words within it. It's like, yeah. he's, he's just, he's not going fast enough. His head's not mm. going fast enough to fucking. I kind of had that though. When I first started listening to hip hop, there'd be a lot of stuff that I wouldn't like understand or like, yeah. Like, or, or it'd be stuff that would take me so many, like I could listen to a, uh, a track by somebody now that I maybe started listening to when I like first started listening to this music and I might notice shit that I didn't notice before oh, or I notice a bar and I like interpret it in a different way or whatever yeah. or, 100% I, mean, I jest I love jest for that because jest is someone I can always listen to like it's not always a great mood for whatever you're doing cause it's a good writer good... When, you, when you understand bars differently yeah. for yeah. over years like that's a sign of a good writer isn't it yeah yeah, it's, it's that's like, hip hop, man. Hip hop is the gift that always keeps giving, man. Yeah. <laughs> that's what it is. Like, yeah, it's a mad fucking like, not to be cliche and shit, but it's a mad little fucking little healer, man. Mm. It's done me a world of good. Yeah, it's that bullshit thing. Is that like, it's cliche as fuck to say. Hip hip hop saved people and stuff. Mm. You know that cliche thing. Yeah, yeah, but it's but true if, though. If you actually if you actually break that down and think about it, yeah, if actually none of us ever had any hip hop, like it was just not about, yeah. like, we'd all be different people. It's um, it? fucking common. Yeah, I don't know what the fuck would I I'd be? We'd be completely different know. people. 100%. Yeah, I don't know what. Yeah, no, we all, we all wouldn't be here. Like, no, we wouldn't be doing this. We wouldn't be doing this. No way. Be, I'd, I'd be like but, skating or fucking. Yeah. I don't even I know. I still be doing film, but I don't know. I won't be doing music videos. I'd be like doing corporate shit. Yeah. I mean, it's mad. Or I don't know, old it, people's homes. I think time. if anything, it just gives you a thing to like live by, isn't it? Well, like a you know, like some fucking. People, I'm not not even like a, it well, it's like weird, if you meet someone at a party, it's way over the top. But you know, people have like religion. Da, 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 da. Yeah. Yeah. It gives you a little fucking guideline or something. Yeah, like. but, yeah it does, man. Like not like religion, I'm not trying to say that, but nah, nah. Like people take it to that flex it. sometimes, but like, yeah, it's not about that. <laughs> nah, but like, people, and but. you know what I mean. Especially in England, people don't really have the same love of that like culture where you mm. respect the whole art form mm. of hip hop and you know what I mean. Yeah, same place like Holland and shit around. and France. Yeah, they do. And like in Europe, yeah, yeah. and obviously yeah, the states, yeah. it's a bit different. Yeah, obviously, with new wave people, it's it's different again. Well, UK yeah. hip hop just mm-hmm. gets overshadowed by grime because that's what people think you're talking about when you when you say UK hip hop. Like to someone who doesn't know, yeah. not what, nowadays. No, no but well, even I think know, maybe when an I fucking of Skinny the UK, Mind's big definitely. outside of UK. Chester P's big outside. They of the UK. are. Four hours are big outside. They're, they're, of UK. Yeah. Big. Split profits are big outside. Yeah, yeah. Of UK. No, I'm not saying that like, there aren't people. Of, obviously, look, obviously there are. It's my yeah, yeah, yeah. But, no, but it, it's, it's like a weird thing where I think. It's underground big right. though. It, it's like it's there are names that poke out, but there's like it's not the same way that if someone would talk about grime, they would be like, Oh no, this person, this person, there's yeah. all no, these that, people coming it's, through. It's, yeah, but like, that's only because it's it's un the, the fact that fucking say split profits and fucking flip tricks and high focus and leaf dog and shit, do you know what I mean? Say the fact that we've and multiple people RLD all the people that yeah, caught yeah, the yeah. bubble yeah. around 2011 yeah. Yeah. you know what I mean and people that were doing it before and stuff yeah. and carried on running through yeah. like that little wave like we had like an underground gold rush yeah no, you know what I'm saying there was like a fucking renaissance like for UK hip hop that came them. through and now all yeah. the scenes that we were hitting up have got their own respective scenes that are big yeah. enough to have their own headline shows where yeah, the exactly. artists are local yeah. and do you know what I'm saying their scenes are massive now and hip hop's just grown all over the place yeah and like for the people that have connected with these other cities and these other countries and shit yeah since the time that you lot come out it's gone mad yeah like, but it, but it's like certain people fucking capitalised, do you know what yeah. I mean? 
and it like it's fucking sick. Yeah. It's mad to see, like it's mad to see what, because it's easy for me to say as well, especially with this podcast, learning so much about the history of even Bristol and like further afield, but like people were hitting like like task force were in Australia years ago, mm. like way before fucking. So Dyke and everyone universal. was like, yeah, yeah so, so do you know what I mean? So all these people were doing this shit before, yeah. you know what I mean? But because there was no internet and shit, yeah. we didn't see the whole story for, and people yeah. going from that A to B. That was dead for ages though, like you lot, yeah, like, no, you but, lot brought that yeah. back around like 100% yeah. because that would... Even there was a space, bro, there was a space because we, we, we heard that shit, we grew up on that shit, yeah, yeah, yeah. that stuff before, yeah. and we were like, where's it all gone? Do you know what I mean? I swear there was like a fucking vortex. Of, it was just like, no, that's what I mean. We, there it is. Like, when we did Bastard Sons, that was that vortex. Time yeah. Because. Yeah, same, exactly. Same with We were Bastard like doing Sun. good shows, but it was only in England. Yeah. And then we were like getting other things and it wasn't organised enough to do the things. We yeah. just didn't do them or whatever. And it's a shame. after that, you lot come through and just, you know. Mm. And, and you know, back to the fucking bigging up two tongues. Yeah. Like yeah, a right? lot of those shows in France, which yeah. eventually led on to other things, came from Two Tongues. Yeah, man. Like Two Tongues put us on in France. To this day, this man, that man has probably like within my friend group the most hyped tune from Spit Proverbs, which is serious business. Mm. To this day, like, I haven't even listened to that song in years, which is kind of sad. But I serious no business. Matter, whenever it came on, there's always one person that always played it, and it's just like, all right. Scared yeah. tonight, like, it just sets the mood. Like, yeah, that tune was so. That was like I think that was the first time we went to Montpellier as well. Like me, that kid, and Paro, I think. Yeah, I think. I think it's Paro. Yeah. Uh, but that was yeah, yeah like. That but yeah, but hard. mate, we fucking like he put us onto this one show we played in. Um, in the Pyrenees, or like by the Pyrenees, mm -hmm. at this place called The Natural Games. And like, we played to like 13 to 15,000 people. Jeez. It was fucking, we had to be insured to go on the stage. They had to take our passport details and insure us just to be on the stage, because it was Where like was it? six meters high. Yeah. Wow. In um, Miao, M-I-L-L-A-U. France. Yeah, in yeah. France, yeah, yeah. And it's like right by the Pyrenees. It was nuts, bro. Like the whole thing was like a an extreme sports festival. Yeah. So like behind the stage, like there was like a stage and then next to the stage there was like a crazy like overhang climbing wall. Yeah. And all this freestyle climb shit. Then back from that there was all the like the stalls and shit. Yeah. And then behind that there was a river where people did fucking like kayaking. Shit man, that's it's nuts, bro, like yeah. And there's that like, like Red the Bull, everything, like, yeah, like jacuzzi <laughs> out the backstage, yeah. like, fucking. Would, mate. You say, would you say that's the most amount of people you've played to? Yeah. 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 Yeah, it was like, and the maddest thing about that one was like, there was pockets of people in the crowd that were spitting the lyrics back. People and like, we were people. so fucking, like, it was that mad, was man. Like, it was one of the maddest experiences I've ever had in my life. Afterwards, we went down to like the little signing thing and that and there was people coming up and getting shit signed and getting like records and t-shirts yeah, yeah, and shit yeah, yeah. it was fucking surreal bruv and like it was all down to two tongues and two tongues like knowing the dude and putting forward the whole proposal yeah. and shit mm -hmm. do you know what I mean he put on for us man and he linked me with La Craps and like DJ Rolex who's yeah, like the, yeah, yeah, the DJ slash producer the for Demi Porchon the, the who's, production of I don't know the, the album from Nedu, Nedue. Nedua. Nedua. Yeah. Um, but that fucking production on that album is insane. Yeah. Is, I think I think a lot of the production on that is DJ Rolex. Yeah, I think it is as yeah. well. I, I think he gets like mentioned in the yeah, like, classic. songs and shit. But yeah, man. I yeah, all those guys. To, like, more like bar and hip hop. Because even though you don't understand the lyrics, there's something about just like listening to the way that it flows still. You get the feeling. Why, like, yeah, like Science Super Crew, like I, 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 like, Super Crew, yeah, right? I got, I got Science Super Crew CD before I yeah, got man. any other hip hop CD. That's mad. Like, yeah, like the fucking X Ray Zone. Yeah. And that shit was just like, to this day, I still put that on 
and like to be fair and fucking KLR like all of their albums man are ridiculous and I don't understand a fucking word but how do you get into like the Cuban music stuff like how, where did that come from what influence was that that came from um it came from like a, a, a ex I was with when I was like maybe like 15 or whatever and she played me Buena Vista Social Club yeah and then literally from that I just like Cuban music like, like avenue into this thing yeah, yeah it was like, it's, it's just that music mm. timing like, yeah. and, and also <laughs> just the whole fucking like I don't know just the thought of being somewhere listening to that in the sun it's like bit, yeah. chilling just, just give it a yeah, yeah, yeah it's, it's nice. just like I don't know there's something about it man Ruben <laughs> Gonzalez <laughs> Shit, dominoes and that. Cars. You have to send me some, man. I have to dive yeah, deep it's, into some of that shit. Like, I'm, yet again, comes back to the musical loop. Yeah. So I do get stuck in, like, yeah, yeah. that circle of either, like, piano players, like, or fucking producers, Ibrahim Farrow. Yeah. Or, do you know what I mean? Is that something you've ever, like, thought of, guess, question for both of you? Have you ever thought about, like, can you play a little bit of like piano or any instrument, or is it mostly like? Yeah, I can play a little bit of piano. Spin. What can what can you play? I play a little bit of piano. A little bit of piano. Is it Enough to like do stuff. Like chords. And <laughs> stuff like, 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 like we taught, or was that stuff you learned like? Yourself? No, I just learned everything from YouTube. Yeah, and that's just, what I was yeah. gonna learn. Like, Ask, like, cause no, I had like piano lessons off of uh, yeah, I had nice. piano oh, piano nice. lessons yeah, originally. Yeah, okay. Off yeah, of yeah. a guy called Luke Type, big mm. up Type, um, originally, and then everything else on YouTube. Yeah, just so <laughs> forward now, mate. You fucking you learn everything I'm learning probably at my university through like YouTube or other website. Yeah, yeah. If you want it, if you, you know. So if you put there, the like, time in, like if you want to do it, yeah. if you, you want to do it, you'll just do it. Isn't it? Like, if you want to learn it, exactly. It's the same with anything, I guess. White more, white more. Should we wrap it up? Oh well, yeah, I reckon we should wrap it up. Shouts to everyone who fucking yeah, duck it out, like, man. Still listening. Oh, fucking sound, isn't it? Big up everyone who didn't ever turn up to everything ever. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Cheers, mate. Cheers, mate. It's alright. Three hours. Oscar held it down. Nice one, G. That's alright. Right, man. Anytime. Alright, then. We're dying. Turn the audio. Whack mold. Whack mold.